feel is like someone that used to play Zero's Zero in Smash 4. And it's definitely someone that's trying to adapt to this game as hard. But, you know, playing a new character, obviously, it could become a little tough. Meanwhile, he's going to be playing against the one and only Tilde, Rock and Falco in this game. One of the three spaces. I mean, I, Falco's actually good in this game, so it's definitely a good pick. Let's see what type of moves he can make out here. Bonke this time opting to uh, stay with the Squirtle. No, nope, there it is. There's Ivysaur. It's like, it wasn't working out, so. That's another thing that Pokemon Trainer Mains can actually, like, employ. So they feel like they're just kind of getting, um... Of losing the advantage state over and over, they can just switch up their entire playstyle by switching the characters up. It could definitely help out in that regard. Here we go, Bankai catches the shield, gets a grab, switches over to Charizard to get the flame breath to force the up B. A little bit too quick with that forward arrow. He's definitely trying to two frame him. Flare Blitz, oh, that's super greedy. Now, Flare Blitz is a move that has huge amounts of knockback. And, uh,. You know, like, it does damage to yourself. A lot of damage. And a little bit of cooldown afterwards. So if the opponent sees it coming, can easily shield it. Get a punish right afterwards. Game man, Bankai. Sitting at 160%. Tilde looking for a uh, potential kill. Gets the down air. Try to get the follow air, uh, forward air follow-up. But that was not a true combo. It allowed Bankai to get the air dodge. But that time, looking a little true. That was OD. Up to the forward air. It's actually my first time seeing Falco in this game, so I'm, I'm really excited. All right, we got the, just the typical jab coming out from Bankai. I think he can get his double jump, opted to go for the Falco Phantasm to get back onto stage. Cool. Good shield grab. Applying a lot of damage right now, those up airs. Ooh, gets caught by the Reflector. Razor Leaf coming in his clutch. Very unsafe Falco Phantasm. Thrown out by Dild Tilde. Bunga could have easily turned that around. Got a grab. Just wasn't in the right state of mind. Two stocks apiece. Trying to go for trades. Now at this point, Tilde thought... Oh, unfortunate for Tilde. He thought that Bunga was going to try to recover low that time around. That's why he had, it went off stage so deep with that back air. But because he guessed wrong, he put himself out there for Bankai to just easily close out that stock. It's the up air against the opponent. Second back air. Nice swing. Falco still got them kicks. Up tilt. Mashing it to get those, da those hits. Applying pressure with all these forward airs. Good parry coming out from Bankai, or sorry, Tilde. Able to get some uh, damage in the process. At this point, you see a lot of pressure being exuded by uh, Bankai on that platform, forcing Tilde to commit to something, but all those active hit frames, there's not much you could have done. Catches the roll with a forward smash, potential edge guard situation for Bankai. Close out, close out the stock yet again. Oh, Tilde actually DI'ing that. We live in. We saw the sparks too. High three might have to upgrade to a high four. Oh, Falco Phantasm's right through it, trying to catch Charizard's big body. Or to potentially send him up into the air. And get some follow ups. So he's bringing this back. Wait a minute. He's got him off stage. Jumping around. Avoids the. That would have been disastrous for Tilde. If he got caught by that, another forward air coming out strong from Bankai. Game number one, narrowly going to win. Tilde was definitely bringing that back slightly at the end. After that, that first forwarder that connected that I thought was going to kill, he ended up DIing it. And once he got back to stage, he started just attacking uh, Bankai and racking up that damage slow, little by little. And uh, could have potentially led that into a kill. Couldn't close it out just yet, but the adaptation is definitely there. And we'll see if we can bring that into game number two with this counter pick going back to Pokemon Stadium 2. Potential character edge guard. Ooh. No, okay. Saw the snake got a little excited for a bit. Was hoping he was going to channel his inner to kill Sage. But uh, going back to the Flacco, hands off his bread. No. Pokemon Discussing with uh, Bankai to clarify some rule sets here before we jump in. Three, two, one, go. 
Pokemon Stadium 2. A good catch right off the bat. So until they jump it right into Bankai trying to get them up tilts. Just so everyone is uh, aware, since we're doing good for time, top eight is best of five. Shield catches the forward smash on the platform. Again, you'll see Tilde doing a lot of jumps, trying to like bait out some options coming out from Bankai. Potential like aggressive. Very unsafe Alco Phantasm. Bankai's gonna be able to capitalize on that. Good transition from Bankai. That was like a that was so fluid, that combo. Switches over to Charizard, runs off stage while the Razor Leaf was still off there and got the uh, stage spike with a back air. Nice challenge for Bankai. Neutral air. Neutral air, one of Ivysaur's greatest moves in his arsenal. Allows him to just be able to just get combos going. Giant leaves coming out from all around, just protecting his body while he tries to challenge his opponent. Miss space in that back air allows Tilde to capitalize on it. Charizard's big body is going to allow him to survive that swing, though, which is why you'll see Bankai switching over to Charizard when he's at high percent. I'm going to go to Squirrel to try to mix him up with the withdrawal move, side beam. Catches the back air, very, like, soft hit, but because he was at high enough percent, ended up taking it away. Oh, Tilde, oh, no! No capitalization from Bankai, though. Bankai felt a little bit bad about that, so give him a little bit of homie stock. Let him get back on stage, I'm sure. You got the forward air follow-ups coming out from Dill there. Applies pressure with those down airs. Again, good reaction. The thing is, if you just hear that sound effect coming out from uh, Charizard, you know there's a big move on the horizon coming your way. Tries to cross him up with a down air. This combos into the back air. Bonkai's struggling here to get this Charizard to work. I'm sure he's seeing great success, but I guess he just needs the one forwarder. Pushes him off stage, eats his double jump, forcing the up B recovery with an easy down air spike. Great gameplay coming out from Bankai. My man's making moves out here. Okay, again, throw out the flamethrower once more. He's gonna stick with the Charizard this time around because he's at, oh, never mind. I'm gonna go for the withdraw instead, try to mix it up with Squirtle. Gets caught by the forward tilt, switches over to Ivysaur while he's high in the air. Neutral air is back onto the stage. It's his double jump, not gonna really capitalize on that recovery. Still keeping this corner pressure alive. Back to the heavyweight, wants to stay alive a little bit longer. The back air, oh, this is start starting to catapult. He flare flits so far off stage. Bunkai, what are you doing? He's trying to style on him. The ball's on this man. The ball's on him. The gall of him. He right, gets the up air. Catching the jump. I just want to push him off stage. And he's going to try it again with the back air. He was up a little bit of stage control, but still gets the follow up on the lag after Falco Phantasm. Coming up with the up special. Man. I keep calling that move Hydro Pump, but it's actually called Water Gun. That's my beat. All right, here we go. Forward air. Gonna go for the classic up throw. The, the classic Kirby up throw. That was invented in 1999, you know? Just comes up. Everyone did do great. I feel like the female trainer is much more happier than the male trainer. It's very similar to, to to Wii Fit Trainer, honestly. You got the uh, Wii the Wii Fit Trainer male is very uh, like angry when he tells you to salute the sun. One of my favorite strategies that Bankai is probably employing into this set is when he is at high percent, switching over to Charizard a little bit more often just to get that heaviest weight, right? Because he's actually the sixth heaviest character in the game tied with Incineroar. So he is a, he is Pokemon what I would say a big boy. So it, it, it's a pretty solid strategy to go for, you know, in comparison to Squirtle, who's one of the lightest characters in the game. My word, my man is uh, 
tied for third with Mr. Game & Watch. That means Squirtle's as light as a piece of paper. All right, back on the mic, you got your boy Jewel. Jewel, what's going on, man? Mike's hot, that's what's going on. Oh, word. So we're jumping into game three in this best three of five set in top eight. All top eight is best three of five. Oh, okay, cool. All of it? All of it. Ooh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I know. I was like, we're in it for the long haul, man. I got I to gotta, I gotta tell you uh, after. Word. Uh, <laughs> right, great follow-ups going out from Bankai. What do you think it is about Pokemon Trainer that you know, so many people are playing them? I, I thought like it was like, oh, okay, Pokemon Trainer's in the game. Oh, well. Uh, or thanks, I guess. It's the, He has the ability to be able to just switch between all three Pokemon at will this time around compared to like the previous iteration in Brawl where there was a lot of cooldown. Yeah. As long as you're not spamming the Pokemon, the down B move, which switches out the Pokemon, you get like invincibility on it and you're able to just switch out very seamlessly. Even if you're like in the middle of hit stun or like... Dude, that he double dipped. Like on stream. You don't do that. I mean, like, God, the Dunkaroo's ready to go, like... In Brawl, you can only swap Pokemon on the ground. That, too. Yeah, yeah. I, I forgot about that. And then, and then, you're, then wide takes... you're wide open for, like, a forward smash. Your Pokemon also gets tired if they <laughs> stay out really for good. long enough. Which, in this game, you could, you could literally just play the same Pokemon over and over. If you so I like that to. tired thing. I always thought it buffed them because of their abilities. Oh, well, you know, yeah, you yeah. don't Pokemon. Uh, uh, but this Falco does. <laughs> Yeah, he is still going for these dares. Yeah. A lot of spikes coming out. I mean, this Duncan, like, he's got the Doritos and Dip ready to go. <laughs> Falco is nice. a man that goes to a party, takes a bite out of the chip, and dupes it again. No shame. He gets a throw. Does that? No. Wow, but he's oh, just whatever. catching. Yeah, see, Bankai didn't know. He didn't know that he uh, didn't have to air dodge. Now, until they finally finds himself with a lead, this could be the sort of uh, some momentum shifting for him. Yeah, laying down that down air, trying to follow up with that dash attack. Oh, narrowly grazing him with dash. Dude, is this really a Falco in top eight? Yeah, Falco's good in this game. I think, I think I would know that if I wasn't bombarded by wolves. No, nah, that's fair. I mean, Wolf's a hot new uh, thing. You, oh, you got to DI catch. out. You have a chance of surviving. All right, just go for the neutral uh, shield. You think he's just going to stay with Ivysaur? Uh, no, I can see him switching eventually to Charizard just to gain that extra weight. Ooh. I don't... Okay. I feel like Charizard is better for, like, stray uh, kills. Uh, speaking of... The second... He swapped over to Squirtle. The second he swapped over to Squirtle, Done. he got killed. Yeah, he, went, he literally went from the sixth heaviest character to the third lightest character. I feel like, like he should have stayed Ivysaur. I think Ivysaur's neutral is the best out of the three of them. I, well, a lot of things that Bankai's been doing with Pokemon Trainer is trying to uh, mix up which Pokemon he wants to play as to try to keep his opponents on his toes, right? Because, like, one second you're finding Ivysaur, and yo! Echo Soul, thank you so much for them bits. I see them bits, 150. We appreciate that. Coming in with them, with the, with, with, with them bits. I love that scene. It's, it's such a good, it's such dumb. a good scene. It's I forget it exists because no one ever gives bits. <laughs> it's actually stupid. Right, I'm hoping to see his combos again. The, the Squirtle combos. The classics. Here we, the up tilt and the up. Oh no, I'm just gone. Here we got the uh, Kalos Pokemon League is the stage of choice. Oh, they're just going back and forth. But should no. he have switched there? Could he have just air dodged? Yeah, but then you feel like with how fast this Falco is playing. Okay. There he goes. Nice job avoiding it. Reads the rolling, by the way. Tilde is starting to adapt to this nonsense. And I'm really liking just this almost Falco. Killed, he just killed himself. And Bankai just no! killed himself. What a great game. And he, he spiked him right next to the ledge. He literally could have just jumped on the stage. Well, this is, a, in fact, a two-stock match. <laughs> All right, Tilda pushing Bankai off. Reads the follows jump. the double jump. This is really bad for Bankai. Uh, opting good to go air dodge. For, yep. Opting to go for the directional Gonna air dodge. Going to push him right back off stage. Yep. 
Flirbits? No. He was, he was waiting for the flirbits. The yeah, no, Bonkai's... Like it was uh, Shine. Not Shine. All right, Tilly's going to be uh, getting these forward airs and back airs ready to go. Here we go. Forward air out of shield. Final damage. Yo! Blitz Dude, him. that's straight from Smash 4. Sour spot in air. My man was ready. But now, this is not looking good for Bonkai. Sitting at 133%. Super close to you know eventually dying. Uh, Bonkai I, needs like I'm a I'm surprised play. he didn't just jump back air. Jump back air. Right what there. What do you mean you're not surprised? He did it. He I did, was surprised. Did, but, but, <laughs> he, but, he, but he did it. He ended up doing it. Yeah. Dude, he, he's playing so fast. Jewel is bringing this back too. Yeah, he, he was down at a two to zero deficit. Bring this back to a game five situation. Now Bonkai is uh, you can tell. Look at Bonkai's face. He's a little stumped. Thinking about he had him like for the first two games, like solid like body bag. Very solid. But uh, Tilde, I think maybe is adjusting to both Pokemon Trainer and Bonkai's playstyle. Best three of five coming in strong. Here we go. Final game. I'm really, I'm really liking this Falco. Here we go. Battlefield getting those tri plats out here. Interesting counterfeit. Options go for the withdraw, try to get the punish with that parry. The best thing you can do against withdraw is either go for like a multi-hit or just jump right on top of it. If you jump on Squirtle during withdraw, it's the best. You literally you get you a charge for You almost smash. don't want to hit him. Yeah. He's so helpless. He, he, he's literally on it's a turtle on his back, dude. It's so sad. <laughs> I'd rather hit Isabel. Why do you think uh Battlefield? I'm not sure, honestly. Because this is a great stage for Falco, but it was Bonkai's counter pick. So it could just be a comfort pick, honestly, because he used to play Zero Suit in Smash 4. Yeah. It does allow Ivy Sword to be able to continue some combos as well. You know, you got the Vine Whips going on down. Yeah, get higher, stage. but no, he's getting lower with the down air. Tilde, that was a really back. low down air, by the way. He bet it all. Nice. Just as he just bet it all with the taunt. Tilde bet it all with that forward smash too. Bond guy just comes out with the back air. Okay, and we're back. To, we're back to the beginning of the game. Yep. Again, two stock match. I feel it. Options go for the Pokemon switch. But he, he's the, not phased by it. He's he's gonna keep throwing out hitboxes. But he he avoided the follow up. And also he maybe wanted to play Ivy Sword, you know? Here we go. Neutral out of shield. Gonna get those combos started. Reads the Ooh. tech roll incorrectly. Oh, whoa. Let's follow up Tilde. You, mean you meant to do that? Or just a razor leaf? Not sure, dude. But Tilde coming in. Up tilt to back air. That looked true. He's got Bonk at 120%. Uh, it's gonna it's gotta be a punish. It's gotta be a punish. Nice. Forward smash, just throw your face at him. Okay, this is actually this is one of the reasons why it's a really good stage for the spaces. Able to fuck. Uh, oh, Falco he had the him. punish. Whoa! The double parry. Yo! My man. Yo! <laughs> that was a double parry coming out from Silver. That was sick. Day. Try to get the that upper was, as well. Yeah, that was a pretty fresh uh, up tilt. And the top flat. That's going to be so uh, no. offstage coverage. Going for the flamethrower. Oh going my mix god. Up. He actually using the wall jump to mix up where he's going to go because he got sick of skiing spiked by Bonkai Charizard. Back gonna, no. You saw the sparks, but I they weren't enough. Done it. Oh, he tries the same thing, but you know, back at, Bonkai just spaced himself. And that has to On be On the it. platform. He exploded, disintegrated. Even. And we're last stock, last match. Winner of this is going to move on to loser's quarters. Let's get it. Up tilt, gonna lead into some aerials. I think he uses double jump. Oh, he, got, he might have he used it. Switch. Does, he, he didn't know that he had. I the second he got caught by the first swing on stage, he ended he up just didn't know. Yeah, he uses double jump right in the middle of that combo. Did not recognize. Thought he still had it right here. He thought he was gonna be able to double jump right out of withdrawal, and he did not have that move ready to go. And so Tilde. Bringing it back from a two to zero deficit with paying attention, I, you know, catching him like falling asleep on the uh, yeah. stream setup. Because he works so hard, I'm gonna get over there and just move the camera. But here we go, Pokemon Stadium two, game one. Adi versus Dill. I keep hearing Pokemon music that I don't recognize, and it's great because they're, 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 they're jams, man. They're jammers. I like 209. This is uh, definitely looking like. Uh, Smash 4 matchup here. We got Dill re repping Diddy and Audi repping yeah, Fox. This big is just shocker. Smash 4 HD, let me tell you what. Oh, he caught his jump. Oh, okay. Dill recognized that immediately. I'm like, I'm not, I'm not doing it. 
Yeah, not gonna commit to that Going one. straight to the platform. And we have a good fox shots coming out from Adi. Trying nice to, Nair. Trying to bait out uh, Dill's approach. Jab yeah, gonna send him off stage. Wow. That Dill is really relying on these air dodges to get through uh, pressure. Yeah, it might, might come back to bite him in the ass later on, but we'll yeah. see. I'm sure Adi has noticed. Let's go. I mean, I don't know what he's... You can actually... He had time to, like, charge an up smash really quick. <gasps> the actual banana peel spawn no. sealed Adi's fate. Good night. Oh, and now he's just looking for something. That... Trying to get the up air afterwards. Is that a thing? Still? He's trying. Oh, so good! The walk. People always run a roll because of how safe back air is on shield. The walk. Just walked up and covered the option. Man doesn't nice. need a dash. Nice. Just waited. The rapid jab coming out. Grab still gonna give uh, Diddy some damage. Trying to get some follow ups with those up airs. Up tilt looks so awkward in this. <laughs> Single laser. Just dead on that free damage. Might as well, you know? Yeah. So Dill tried to make it look like he was running away from all the pressure, and then he came back with a monkey flip. But apparently, uh, Adi was ready for it. Yeah, he has the up airs he's, always he's ready. He's caught on with the, the air dodges. He was trying to fall down with that neutral, trying to bait out, like, because if Adi gets a sour hit in neutral, that probably still confirms into an up smash. Mm -hmm. It's, like, even better in this game. Ooh, he's trying to get the uh, Z drop up smash. Dill That's a DI just... mix up, right? Yeah. I mean, uh, he was definitely trying to get that uh, up smash out here ready. Nice spacing. Yeah, not going to fall for the mix up this time. Dill, SDing yet again. Third one. My man Dude, just, that sounds like it hurts. And he tried to get him with the forward air footstool. I don't, I'm not sure that works in this game. Yeah, neither of them too shaken up by it. It pseudo works. You pseudo. can't footstool someone when they're in tumble, but if they act, if they act out of tumble with a jump, you can footstool them at that point. But he just upbeat. It's all about exactly. It's all about being patient. Down tilt into forward nice. air. Gonna get that to connect. Dill still one stock away. Taking off this first game, but he is taking on a lot of damage. He got that B reverse with the banana peel without uh, the momentum. And here we go. <laughs> that was Adi's plan. He okay, says so these double jumps. Yeah, watching out for those falling nares. And Dill didn't really want to commit to that banana uh, toss, even though he like was added jumps because he knows it's a bait that Bodies just wants him to yeah. let go of his item. He'll probably stay under those platforms just so Adi can't fall on him. Uh, but off stage, yeah. Nice. That was a just keeping stage. Option select. He spawned the banana peel to cover the right option, and his backer was covering the left option. Oh, uh. reads the tech wrong. Big punish? Oh, no punish. Yeah, I That don't shield. Think <laughs> looking super He needed small. something to get out of there. Nice monkey flip. Just claws his face this a bit. time. He's been uh, monkey flip kicking. Dill is still in stage control and the lead. Oh, but wait. Up. He's going off stage. He's going to chill backwards. Tries to go off stage. What was that? I think he tried to go for a trump. but uh, Or maybe With just a, a neutral air off stage to just catch the rocket barrel boost if he's going to recover a little bit away from the stage. Nice. And but the Nair. The Nair still takes it. And what was that? Up oh, smash. I'm just gonna land right there. Ooh, dude, the shield pressure. So good. Sour spot, neutral air into up smash. Always North of a... 110. Yup. Still looking for the Nair. No, we got Dill. The hitbox is bigger, right? For the up smash? It looks bigger. I, I think it is. It looks like, like the sweet spot is bigger. Dude, the back air is on shield. Is so good. Yeah, but it's very safe to just smack your opponent's shield real quick with your foot. Stop battle. 
give yourself some spacing. Come back in, maybe get a grab follow-up. Bowser? Now I know. Oh, that's that's Audi playing Bowser. Oh yeah, you no said Audi. Really? Audi has a Bowser. Yeah. He's been picking up Bowser's game. For, some, for a second, I thought Dill was playing Bowser. And I was like, what? Well, now he can't get jabbed, but it's not like Dill jabs. Yeah, so with Bowser, what offers to the table is definitely the tough guy effect. Allows you to be able to go through uh, softer hit moves. And just go right through them and just ignore them completely as Bowser. There's yeah. a lot of super armor and a lot of his swings as well. A lot of his tilt smash attacks. Yeah, but how much, how much does that matter in this matchup, though? I mean, I honestly, I've never seen the matchup in Ultimate yet. So I guess we're going to see momentarily. Okay. Good <laughs> so cool. catch. Got some trades going on into the forward air as well. Nair is going to get canceled by the banana beer. Yeah. Now in this game, uh, Bowser's neutral air is a kind of a great combo starter for himself. Allows yeah. him to try to get in there and get a follow back towards it. Goes for the jab. I think it does like 28% by itself or 22. It does a lot of damage. Oh, and up tilt stronger as well. Ooh, throws the field down. Goes yeah. for the down throw for the damage and spacing because up throw up air is yeah. not really a thing anymore. No longer Bowser. the grappler he was. No. <laughs> <laughs> just gonna move him. Yeah. He thought he was gonna do a normal get up. Or because oh, wow, if, if you dash at your opponent like that, it covers both neutral get up and roll to the right. So that's why you'll yeah. see a lot of players do that. But get up attack, unless he was gonna push shield. Yeah, you know, he reacted too late. Mm -hmm. yeah, you get... you're, you're you're gonna see that a lot from Bowser. The run up, short hop, fair. Very similar to Charizard's gameplay. Yeah, it's sh both of them shield poke really easily. He's going for a big read with that down smash. Dill's just going to capitalize on that all day. Waits for the roll. Off stage. And this is the problem with like heavyweights versus Diddy Kong, right? Is that they just have so much trouble trying to outmaneuver this little chip hand. Team. Yeah. Can't find his way out of there unless he just lands a hit. Nice. Parry. Not going to get him anything. Oh, he had the right idea. I don't think he meant to full hop there. Oh, Ooh, that footstool. No, okay. Not enough to get the kill just yet. Up yeah. tilts at a shield. Really good. Has way more range this time around as well as a good knockback. I love how quick this big thing is. Yeah, Bowser's really quick, and the, the new update where you can like tilt out of dash exemplifies his dash a lot more. They go over the back air, but Bowser is the heaviest character in the game. He's gonna yeah. be living for a while. For another like 30% before Dill uh, is looking to take it with like uh yeah, that's not gonna do it. Down tilt the back air, but that damage is slowly starting to creep upwards. Nice. Cannot find his way back to the stage. Dill is dominating the control. Finally gets one more back here, and Audi's stock has been eliminated. Nair's out. I thought he was going to chase him with Nair's, but yeah, Audi was Dill uh, too smart to try to land on on a swinging bounce. Yeah, there was no way he was going to go for that air dodge that Audi was definitely looking for. Back throw has him off stage. Tries Ooh, okay. to go for a down air. Gosh, Hit him come. with like the, the landing hitbox. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, bad situation. Oh, Dude, if he got that bear, that might have been The out. monkey flip challenging the back air. Yeah, it came out first. Ooh, does the parry into grab. He's getting these parries, the yeah, but he's, he's not getting anything from them. Yeah, he's uh, just not recognizing where his opponent's going to land. after you, hear, you know, you just hear the sound effects, you just go for a quick move. Yeah. He's getting them. <laughs> the well, oh, power shields on uh, projectiles, the parry. Are Earlier, by the way, uh, creative recovery from Dill. Get back to the stage. Like sometimes you just can't get anything off of a parry, and that's okay because you're saving your shield because you're dead. Yeah. I mean, he's never bad. Yeah. Audi coming down with that neutral a little bit too soon. Dill still had iframes from the spawn back to spawn him. Now things are looking pretty bleak for Audi. Dill just needs one banana toss or down tilt into a confirm. Bowser doesn't need too many. Uh, he doesn't need to get in too many times. Just get the forward air follow back Actually, backwards. air dodges that. Yeah, he had a little bit too much rage. He's not too scared, but scared enough. If Adi ca gets, catches wise That's today. exactly what he was baiting. That's exactly what he was baiting, the aerial approach. The thing is, eventually, Adi was going to have to, you know, make a move. Because he was technically losing, and Dill is no stranger to just, like, not playing the timer, but just not approaching and just continually doing, like, I'm the, not saying the Dill dials. couldn't have reacted to anything else, but... That was what he was planning on. Like, you're going to approach from the air because I'm making it a pain on the ground. Hook, line, and sinker. And... Again, not saying Dill couldn't react to, like, say, you know, uh, he tries to hop behind him or whatever. But, like, that was exactly what Dill was expecting. 
Well, why did you switch in the first place? I guess maybe you see his Fox was a uh, main chance getting a little bit too aggressive, too uh, too carried away, and Dill was like adapting too too fast. But he's going back to Fox. Yeah. Maybe this time around it'll feel a little bit better. Another thing is he maybe could try to like uh, quote out gimmick his opponent unquote with a brand new character he has doesn't have time to adapt to. But Dill definitely knows how to fight against yeah. heavyweights. That uh, maybe he just wanted to see like what would happen with you know being a, a game ahead. Nice. Just gonna lead into a grab. Now we are going to town and city. Chips on the banana peel. Wow. Tries to get that up smash. I want to hear the forward throw again. Nice. Gets the banana peel into a fox illusion combo. Yeah, I don't think Dill is playing yet that, like his opponent knows how to handle his banana. Just because it's a different game doesn't mean uh, Adi is any less knowledgeable with what to do. Right above that uh, F smash. Fixing him up. Options recover down from really behind. Really was a really good situation for Adi, but he's going to get grabbed. Still rolling in, the, in between him. Two a rare miss tech from Adi. Yeah, oh, that was the second jump too, right? Yep, opted nice. just go for the rocket barrel boost. Still really seven. good uh, horizontal recovery from Diddy. No capitalization from Adi either. <gasps> that was an up smash. That had to be. He was, yeah. was thinking about it. Something that I think is catching a lot of people off is that you can't jump cancel anymore. Yeah. So, yeah, you can't. So you just do run up, jump A, and yeah. then there's your forward air, and you're like... <sighs> He's, he's still going for what he needs, but he's trying to go about it a different way. And that's going to uh, tie the stocks up. Jab going to... Okay. <laughs> that banana was definitely important. So what's up with banana? Like, when does it actually go away? Is it just timed? Fire. All right, here we go. Adi's getting back onto the stage. He's got 129%. Turn out the neutral airs. Good, just jumps right behind him. Wants to get the grab instead. Back air back. Ooh. Gonna catch the side B. Yeah, good catch. All right, going with the dash tag. Nice. Back air conversion. Wait, gets the monkey flip right onto him. Dash attack. Dash attack actually leads into fair. Like, it's true. Up smash. Catching the air dodge right through him. Nice back up. But Dill ready for it. DI mix up again. Gonna get him the forward air. That was a free punish from Dill. Could have easily gone for a grab. Still not used to it stopping on shield. Yeah. Definitely was thinking that Fox was just going to go right Yeah, through. right behind him. Yep. Too used to it. Try to go for the shield grab. Wow, covers his, his landing with a, a jab of all things. Yep. Oh, so if it trades with something, or if it clashes with something, it still goes through. It doesn't stop. That's wow. Just jump back here. Bankai shaking his head at that as Dill takes away game number three. Starting off with a 2-1 lead. Bankai's got to get something going. I think that's why he wanted to switch off a of Fox from game yeah, one. Yeah, he saw something in that first game. Yeah, even though he technically won the game, he knew the adaptation was coming, so he just wanted to mix him up. So we're going to see if anything new comes out from Bankai, if he's going to stick with the Fox. Or this could be it. I feel like we're not really playing Fox in this. Like in this set, it's been Diddy. Wait, what do you mean... Like, Dill. like Fox is supposed to be oppressive, and he's not. He's not been able to play Fox. He's been definitely having some hard times trying to and find while, his opening. Yeah, and while Dill hasn't been dominating, he's been playing his game. He's honestly looking for that forward tilt. Dude, I love his down throw. He really chucks people. 
Yeah, they go up flying up there. The they go flying horizontally hard, or vertically, I mean. Hey, Dill's, you notice that Dill's kind of chilling on that platform. Yeah, I already noticed too, and just <laughs> went up there to meet him. It's like, whatever, man, I'm going to go up there and get those grabs. Okay, I'm going to get him off. Monkey flip follow-up. He fared him, convinced him that shield was the better option, and then grabbed him. It was a really good sequence. He's going to reflect that heal right back into Fox. Off stage. Uh, or not. Wow, he's trapped. Like a rat. Monkey flips raw right into his face. Almost got the kill to boot. Dude, is Fox all right? Uh, he needs some help, dude. We got we got to call an ambulance for him. We need to get the get the stretcher from Titan can, City. Can we check Stat. his eyes? Ooh, up tilt. Gonna be able That's to be up there and follow up. It. Okay. Dill to recover off stage. No. He is completely okay. vulnerable. Free down smash for Roddy. Not sure what compelled Dill to let go of that ledge and maybe it was a missed input. Had to be. With the air dodge and everything? Yeah. Had to be. But, you know, Adi's not too upset about it. They can be able to get the close out that stock for free. And now Adi is getting a chance at this fight again. Town City's gonna back him up. Got the new state layout coming out from town. Bringing it back to the OG. With the three blocks. Ops to throw it off stage. Rapid jab against the shield. Oh, good response from Dill. He's jumping above it. Yeah. That's what you have to do sometimes. Some people will just hold it. I like what Adi was doing earlier with the Nairs uh, to just call out Dill's jumps. He was doing that a lot in game one, and I think he did it oh, only a little so far in this game and the game before. I think he should rely on Nair a bit more, just as an anti-air. Oh, the platform game started starting to get stretched off a bit. Oh, yes. Kick him right back off. Trump, this is going to be... Oh, uh, that was an opportunity for Audi. Last time he re-grabbed, uh, so he thought he was going higher this time. Yeah, Audi was definitely waiting for Dill to go for a rocket barrel boost onto the stage. Which is why he didn't want to like commit to the down smash. There we go, monkey flip kick. Banana nice. peel allows him to get the back here. He got caught by the Firefox, though, and we gave up tech. stage control. Narrowly avoiding that forward smash. I was gonna fly in spawns of an ampule to give Adi himself some breathing. Adi playing this one a lot better. Mm -hmm. So oh, he had the idea. So I'm looking for that up smash. Gets the footstool. No. Oh, he wanted the wow. down air and just throws his stock away. What a reverse. What a, what a, what a, what a homie. What, didn't even need that stock. That's right, the Dil? second time Dill has given him a free stock in this game. That is probably the fifth time I've seen Dill die needlessly today. Here we go. One stock apiece. Dill one game away. One stock away from moving on to loser's quarters. Can he pull this off? Adi chasing him without bears. Puts him right on the plat where he wants him but gets hit by the get up attack. Yeah, that was a good that was a good response coming out from Dill. Didn't caught Adi a little bit off guard. Because Adi's definitely looking for like sort of rolls. Good parry to just help him escape the situation. Yeah. Try to do more with it, but gets him out of disadvantage, so that's good too. Yeah, it's the forward throw. Now Adi is looking for this sour hit neutral air. Potentially leading to an up smash. Dill hyper aware of it. Goes up, gets the grab, tries to rack on some damage in the process. Yeah, there has been more Fox happening this game. Oh, that could have been big. He was reading the other way. Yeah. If you would have just air dodged in a little bit more. Really smart option by Dill. Again, good catch from Audi. Reading Back it. Oh! The banana peel killing. We got snipes. And we have a taunt to boo. Bunkai feeling himself. This could be the start of some momentum. For the game five. And hopefully he can carry it into the final game. The walk again. Yep. That's how you know Adi's playing on fire is when he's just walking. Because he knows, like, you're going to you're gonna do something stupid. You're going to roll. <laughs> I got up smash with your name on it. Here we go. Game five. Dill thinking, considering Yoshi's Island Brawl. Potentially could be a good stage. A fine stage for him. Allows that platform to cover a lot of the stage so he can easily, like, you know. Yeah. Gra that, that grab his peel. Scary. Yeah, he can grab his peel on the platforms, like pretty much from wherever he is. Like a Diddy at center stage yeah. on Yoshi's Island? That sounds really good. But scary. might just go for the comfort pick instead. Pokemon Stadium 2 coming back at you live. Game 5. Potential counter pick? No, my man's gonna play Diddy. He's hovering. 
I know he likes King K. Rule, but not, 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 not right now. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen. Which one was over? Uh, no, uh, just Dill has a King K. Rule, a pocket. I've never seen him bust out in a tournament before. He's a troll character. It was one of the first characters he played. He really enjoyed him. Chucks it off stage. Did it. Dill did exactly what Audi wanted. Pull out another banana, mm. and I'm gonna punish you. Simple. Okay, Audi is going to ham actually. Covering a little bit too. Yeah. Deep. Okay, this is the confidence now coming out from Odyssey as you can see him starting to move. Thirty percent off of rocket barrel boost. My God. Down air. Ooh. Okay. A little bit too high a percent. Great DI coming from Audi, avoiding that by holding left. Yeah, he wasn't gonna <laughs> just put his controller. Nice. Oh, good spacing coming out from Dill, avoiding the shield grab. Off stage again. Let's get that peel out of here. We are schmixing right now. Audi. That bear does not send as horizontal as it used to. Neutraler just throws out the sex okay, kick. Okay, just going to take the banana peel first and then recover after. And Dill had the monkey flip there because if you had to the ledge, completely vulnerable. Sour yeah. hit. Not in dub smash. Just goes for the grab yeah, Audi instead. is following him. Goes for the banana peel instead of the. Oh, he's making Dill the stock anyway. He's making Dill feel like he, there's no correct option for him. The like, oppressive fox. Yeah. Okay, avoids the grab. Oh, a little bit too soon. Thought he was gonna let it, let go of it a little sooner. Oh. Okay, good Audi going for the double jump instead of forcing a tech situation. He tried to make it look like he was gonna go for a banana peel and then he put a fair between them. Good mind games coming out from Dill. Back air. Oh, rocket barrel boost. Him again, going for these short hop neutral airs. Yeah, it seems like whenever he, he's lost his jump and he's still getting hit, he'll just air dodge into the ground or the platform. Uh, Dill's gonna be looking for these down tilts to get some confirms. Oh, fair. Down tilts. Both of them playing uh, a lot faster this game five. Dancing around the shield, Dill's not budging. Good old Tomahawk. Banana peel finally back out. Grabbed it through his shield? What? I was gonna say that's probably going off stage, but the dash attack just wasn't spaced. And we have that forward air to catch that monkey flip. Dill coming back in, throwing out all these back airs, forward tilt to push him off. For the oh. Punish? Oh, a little, a little slow on the upkeep. Yeah, and like it's not not as much of a thing in this game. Nice. Off stage again. It yeah, Dill good. actually going to hit him away first. Yeah, that seems to be Dill's game him. plan in this game, right? Just keep Audi away so it gives him time to grab his tool that he needs, the banana peel. Yeah. His entire neutral relies on that. I, I, I appreciate this could be a bad spot for Dill. I don't think Audi's going off stage. Yeah. Doesn't want to risk it. Not at all. Not with his lead. That, that was his jump to another SD. Self-destructing like crazy. He needs a he needs a sour nair. Just goes for the raw up smash instead. Audi trying to send home a Made message. it look like he was going for a grab and then went for the up smash, but Dill not biting. Saying I'd rather get grabbed than anything else. If orders the case with the retreat, yeah, now got the, a little antsy. Banana peels back out. Dill, I feel like, has stolen this game. The second Audi SD. Yeah. It is just like he lost all momentum they had going, and Dill is capitalizing. He is out of jumps. Potential spike. Why oh, didn't he commit to the downer? Yeah, he had to right? stop the throw away. I could have. He rolled in again. But Audi, because of, because of the now, disadvantage. Because Dill didn't want to commit to the downer, Audi could potentially bring this back. Dude, we got Vortexes. Down tilt. Wants to get him set up. He needs to pop him up. Oh, he tried. Yeah, the, the pinky toe narrowly missing his hat. It's the jab. Okay. Pushes him off stage. He's... No way he really he really willingly put himself above Fox. And Bonkai. And now he's back to the side. Oh. Playing so smooth. Oh, the shine spike. Rocket he oh! can't get back to stage. That shine. is it. Bonkai coming out here. Odyssey. Audi. Audi, what did I say? Bonkai? My bad. I meant Audi. They're both running oh the same shirt. Oh my god. Odyssey. Wow. That was all. That was 100% Dill's fault. Kept pushing to the right because Dill wasn't allowing that.
Okay, let's let's change up the pace a bit here, right? We got we got Jen <laughs> fighting off against Wishes, Inkling against Palutena. Now, Jen knows this matchup. He plays against John Numbers a lot, so definitely this is gonna be a different style. This is an Inkling. Yeah, probably a new breed of uh, Inkling, though. Yeah, this is an Inkling that knows how to do the up throw up air combo. <laughs> I'm not sure. Damn. Maybe John's learned in the past few days. I don't know. But John keeps saying it's impossible. And I keep seeing Inklings do it and not him. So I'm going to keep calling him out until he freaking learns it. Appreciate the yellow and not the vanilla skin, by the way. Yellow is a, a popular color, too, because it's the hero skin, you know? Mm -hmm. it's, it's got the cool layouts, the blonde. Ooh, good uh, movement coming out from Wishes. Really good. And he's going to yeah. get that confirmed you talked about. Baited out the forward tilt hardcore. Put Jen into a panic state. Now here we go. Jen's got a potential edge Air guard. Early, trying to minimize. Oh, I thought the, the spike was jump. coming. Now the thing is, that's there's only two frames to catch him on that. That's one thirtieth of a second to be able to catch your opponent with that down tilt. Super jump's mm -hmm. really hard to catch. And you saw Jen connect that down tilt. Such a long lasting move. A very good option for Palu. And reacting immediately with the mm -hmm. follow up. It's the hit confirm. He thought he was going to jump out of shield. He had the neutral air ready to go. Oh, that close? She's still sitting at 95. Nice uh, neutral air dodge. Dash attack ready to go. He had that up tilt. Oh, no. You is he? It, no, okay. No, the bad thing is against Inkling, if you ever commit to anything, I'm talking like roll, spot dodge, a, maybe even a dash, like a foxtrot back and forth, yeah. you leave yourself wide open to get pop, uh, grounded. That was nice. just a raw the up shield. smash. The shield went right through it. Okay, Inkling. I see you, Wishes. Yeah. Wishes is playing really close to Jen. He can't get the space he wants. Here we got back airs again, just trying to outspace him. Goes for the roller. Not safe on shield, my guy. Taking some damage. Nice nair. He couldn't punish it. Oh, and he Drifted is away with it and everything. Trying to take that to the ultimates, but now he's sitting at 149% off stage against Inkling. Very scary spot. Jen trying to find his opening back to center stage. Manages to find it. Oh no. They move so quick, you hardly have time to zone them. Able to reflink the splat grenade right back at his opponent so it's no longer a threat. Good option that Jen really hasn't been employing too much in this uh, game so far. Mm -hmm. Down throw into. Uh, read the jump up smash. Yeah. But. Wish is going to drift out of it. Nice roll. Yeah, up he wasn't really prompted to, but he did it, uh, and it worked out. Yeah, at this point, up throw up air from Inkling will not connect anymore, but that but certainly this will. will. All the time in the world to connect that forward smash. Okay, Wish is Try to catch a roll in. Nice. In, out. Yep, again, that rapid jab, really good, just putting ink on your opponent, lowering their defense. Oh, that grenade's not going to help oh, at all. She is the yellow. The knockback. Challenges wow, the he roller. tried to end it there. Tried to get that edge guard with the neutral air. Uses warp to get back to stage safe and sound. But Jen sitting at 89%. Okay, Jen actually looking out for these uh, these rollers now. He has platforms to play with as well. So if he sees that Wishes gets a little I roller don't think happy, there he goes. Saw the roller coming immediately. Yeah. Short hop neutral air gets the Put kill. In. I don't think he wants to be on these platforms, though. Because of that. Uh, well, not because of that. But, but that's one we, reason. Yeah, we can add that to the list. <laughs> I'll be like, this is a long grocery list. But what else? Uh, because of how fast Wish has, has been playing. Yes. He's. If you saw him at the start of the game, he was pressuring the heck out of Jen. Under him. Under the under the platform. Never forget those up fox airs. shots. It was, oh, my God. I mean, it was dash dancing back. And it's forward. low profile, too. Mm -hmm. That's one of the things that makes Inkling such a good character in the neutral is that, like, when she dashes... She, she, she's low profile. And also, it looks very similar to when she does a roll. So you don't know if it's a dash or a roll either. Yeah. It's, the animation's very, like, uncanny. <laughs> dash tag, dash tag. Not sure if that was on purpose, but uh, very risky on shield. Not too much damage in the process, though. Only sitting at 21. Oh, that shield looking mad low. This is uh, Jen's opportunity to try to push, push his pressure. thought we were going to see a shield poke with how the shield was looking, but I guess not. Neutral air onto the ledge. Yeah, Tries to follow up with an upper. Fall out of it with the plat. Bombs out. Nice. Double I like fire. how Jen didn't just like press any button after he heard the sound. 
So you're gonna play play it patient. That rapid drive to put a tack on some more ink to Palu. Ooh, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah, she's looking yellow. She's gonna get even more. That is like maximum yeah. ink right now. That is 1.5 times more damage. I thought it was 1.8. Uh, that was apparently uh, John numbers corrected me on that. Apparently that was patch 1.0. In patch 1.1, it was uh, fixed. Oh no, the Mewtwo. Hate to see it happen. That's why this is our this is in our Smashville. Yeah right. Here we A go. Quick 33%. Oh, oh, that he didn't mean to do that, but yeah, recovery is good enough where you're not too scared. Jen had but the. You should smash. be scared of getting grabbed by Paolo. Yeah, that, that grab just immediately landed into an up smash for free. We're back here. I mean, All right, here we go. Two stocks apiece. Was reading, reading the dash back. Yeah, was definitely expecting wishes to start moving there, but wishes just held onto his shield. With the roll. Now, what's the, what's actually good about using the roller to backwards is that Inkling puts paint on the ground. So yeah. what happens is when the ink's on the ground, it forces the opponent uh, the opponent moves slower. So if like Jen gets really aggressive and it chases oh, after him, does? yeah, he'll get lower mo mobility. So that is that could be a strategy wishes is trying to go for. Because he nice. also knows that Jen didn't like play aggressive at all because he knows it's a thing. Yeah. Grounded, up smash. Oh, okay. Oh no. That was Wishes messing up the easiest combo in the book. But <laughs> <laughs> is it? Have you done it? <laughs> Not to be fair. No, I haven't. But all right, here we go. I don't play Inkling. Two Back stocks to one. Though. Overhead toss. Yeah, held that one. Oh yeah, with the platform, getting in another up air. Jen, not too phased by it, but it gotta be rattled. Oh, I got that neutral. I was trying to get the follow tech read afterwards. Air dodge nice. gonna be able he, to punish He reacted it. to it, to the DI. Yeah. Yeah, I think more people should just yeah. that was go definitely off and a strike him. Mm. Nice. Challenges the roller. Gets the back air the right back through air, the shield. He is back way air, too again. hungry for that. I would, that's Palutena 101. Yep. Well, thing is, Jen is, Jen is just reacting to Roller at this point. He's not even trying to call it out. Yeah. But, I mean, with the stock being a stock ahead, like, which is like, I can end the game now. Yeah. Uh, but if you want to let me, that's fine. I have another stock. He's fishing. I'll think later. <laughs> that was a forward smash. Back so air, going to do it. Gets punished for it. Now, Jen's sitting at 103% on his final Triple stock. Triple digit deficit. Even him. I feel like he needs an edge guard. Otherwise, you're either killing with a with a surprise up smash, or you're not winning the game. Or just play neutral out of your mind. Here we go. It yeah, begins. over and over. Whoa, using the platform. Trying to catch the up air. Just nicks him through Multiple. the air dodge. Uh, Jen is Dude, this, this advantage back. date? He has is it done? Stage. He has him off stage. He was trying to look for that spike as well. It's not done. Through the roller oh, with that grab. He goes he for the air, air dodge. dodges away. Super jump coming out. Down tilt. He should just... Fall off the stage with a nair. We got the back. Is he gonna throw. do it? He tries to pop him up with a dare, or the, the, grab. the down tilt. Back throw off stage. Dude, Dude has it? The when's the last time he's been touched? Neutral air. And just there as it I is. Call, just as I called it, man, wins the neutral the entire time. Jen playing Dude, absolutely no, he clean won, that He stock. won neutral like twice. He just and like, just didn't get hit. He was just on a ramp. Dude, page. what? Dude, what's up with today? Like, in being clutch? New game, Like, man. Jen, you didn't need to win that game. <laughs> you know? Right? Yes, he did, man. He wanted to tie that score one to one. Jumping into game three in his best three of five set. Let's get it back to the Inkling, back to the Palu. Back to the Pokemon Stadium. Yeah. <laughs> Go! Are you going to take Ooh. that trade? Good music, by the way. Yeah. That's the other thing. It's like uh, uh, instead of like the Animal Crossing music that we've been hearing in Smash Four, now we get Pokemon music. Pokemon has some godlike music. It does. <gasps> All the way off. Another SD. I, is this just like this has to be nerves from the players today, or just new game factor? Yeah, they don't I think it's new game. They don't quite understand how far they can push their uh, recoveries. Yeah. Or how far they should. Yes. Okay, there we go. Nice reaction again with the DI. I'm guessing Jen is used to following that missed dare up with something. 
like a, a, a run-up grab or a dash attack. Uh, but it seems like Wish is like it's too quick on the buttons. Like if he wants to get away, he's just gonna leave. Yeah, that's one of the things that Inkling's really good at doing. Is just yeah. like, she has such high mobility, allows her to just dash away. They're trying to paint the floor a bit. Up air after the off throw, good DI coming survive out from that, Jen. and I think that's gonna put him out outside of the percents. So getting grabbed is a okay. Yeah, Wish is definitely gonna be, uh, keep keep grabbing the pocket, but not a priority anymore. Yeah, looking for the roller now. Yeah, understand. Jen sees it coming, has the back out ready to go. Oh my god, this music's so good. It's the parry. Another one? Another one. Too greedy. Could have got easily gone for like a forward tilt. Usually he's not greedy with the yeah, parries. Yeah, yeah. Maybe like hey, he, he, fe he felt it. Yeah. He felt it in that one. Gonna get some ink back. Yeah, Inkly. Dash out, dash in. And come in with a fair. Gonna get an advantage. Just a beautiful splash. Ends with the stock. Beautiful spy grenade being displayed by Wish. Oh, the, that whole the sequence at the end there, where Jen thought he had a, a slight advantage and he just ends up losing his stock, it was so good. And I'm, that's what I'm saying. Fall off with an air. It, it doesn't have a hitbox. Jen's edge guarding on point. Yeah, he's figuring it out uh, as the set goes on. Okay. I appreciate the respect for both players. And get some ink on him. Neutral air. Oh, Nair into Nair into Nair. He's going to continue it with the platform. Oh, doesn't get the forward air. Good DI from Wishes. Just opting a DI away from the combo. Punishes the dash attack. Up throws with the platform. And Jen wants to get off that platform. He's sitting on his final stock already. See, the platforms are like. Saving grace, but they're also they also help Inkling with combos. Oh, no, it was just but they they keep you from dying to that roller. But God forbid like you get grabbed on him. Pick your poison, you know. Okay, Jen knows that nice. The roller or the grab could seal Jen's fate, and so he's keeping on his toes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> explosive flame. If he's That's gonna, what you got to do. He's just gonna move like that. I mean, okay, follow up. Oh, Beautiful. that was some. And now we, we might be seeing a, re a repeat of the previous game. We saw Jen at this big of a deficit, and then just proceeded to just play out of his mind against Wishes. Uh It begins. I think now Wish. Okay, I don't want to say anything. I feel. Like, I feel like Remember we're gonna. Last I'm gonna time? Yeah, I'm gonna time? say yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's okay. just gonna die. There he goes. He got the grab. That's gonna connect into an up air, and that's gonna be the death. Oh. Wait a and minute. And he's outside of percents again. Dude, Great. it's the repeat. Great DI coming out from Jen. Trying to he live can as no long as possible. He no longer grab to kill. He's going to put some ink on him. It's safe for, for Jen to just hide in his shield. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Goes for the warp. Back there would kill. 170%. Literally, like, the smallest little sneeze could kill him. Mm -hmm. Playing safe with the neutral air. Tries to go for a grab. Nice Not a safe. surprise bear. Oh, oh warped onto stage. Hasn't done it the whole set. Wishes was not ready for it. Air dodge into the ground. Okay, expecting the grenade. Just goes for the forward air out of a short hop. Okay, your nice. boy Wishes taking away game two. Says, I'm not getting grabs. I'm not getting uh, the roller. You must be jumping. <laughs> that, yeah. That's what you must Here be doing comes. to avoid everything. I mean, eventually, you don't need your you don't need your conventional grab into up throw up air mm -hmm. or your roller into up smash. You just go for a just keep on tiling damage because like Inkling, like I said, is really good at attacking on damage. So just keep it going. Yeah. Rapid jab is such a good move for her. All right. So hopefully we're gonna get a game where uh, Jen doesn't SD. Yeah. Uh, please. There we go. Tag on that point yeah. three damage. Yeah, he's just trying to frustrate him yeah. because of how safe Jen is playing. The down tilt, try to cover the two frames. Obstacle for the neutral air covers a lot of options. Get up attack, get up while, and get up jump. While he plays safe, if he gets a hit, he's he's gonna go for more. Yeah, that I mean that's just like Jen, that's Jen's playstyle in a nutshell, right? Just win that neutral and just push it all the way. He's got him at 92. Looking nice to try save, to Bear. Might be looking to try to save out his back air. The dash attack. You never know when they're coming. Because usually they, they run up and uh, grab you. Sport air is right through the shield. Rapid jab pushes him off stage again. 
No down tilts coming out. Ooh, they're scrapping. Back there, not gonna do it yet. But I'm gonna put him in a. I thought the nair was coming. Oh, down but he doesn't tilt. need it. You hung yeah, up. no way fair was killing. You hang on to the ledge too but long. That will. You see the super jump coming out. Long lasting hitbox that is Palutena's neutral air. Gonna be able to challenge it. There we go. Just keep up challenging these advances from Jen. The full dash. Oh, wow. Wasn't able to get the punish. Get up attacks are better in this game. Ooh, again, the up throw up air. Booyah combo. Yeah. Gotta look out for that grab. Yep. It can kill. Ooh. Yeah. They're both, like, feeling each other out. Seeing which hitboxes would land. Oh, man. Nice back air to back air. Yeah, just connecting these aerials again and again. Neutral air is out of shield. Good tech read with that back air. Or forward air, I mean. Yeah, he tried to... Wishes tried to space him out. Because he knew another hitbox was coming. But he ended up getting pushed off stage. Jen SDing again. I said hopefully. No way he really SD'd again. Well, I mean, we can check the tapes, but... Okay, 99%. He must have gotten gimped. <laughs> yeah, we saw the tape. He definitely just SD'd again. Okay, he's got him at 105%. Jen catches him with the up tilt. Great up tilt. Uh, I tried to call him out. No back throw? Trying to get a follow-up afterwards. He's trying to get, like, a read. Mm -hmm. Back throw, because back throw wouldn't have killed. He just would have given him stage control. Forward throw to push him off stage. And now look who has stage control. Yeah, now Wish is just trying to get damage. Get off me. Oh, that, too early. Right is, idea, though. The thing is, Wish's ink is starting to get super low, so Jen's trying to keep this offensive going. Mm. Neutral air off the super jump. Not Couldn't get the final hit, the, the swing to connect. Oh, Whoa! Air. That was a weird challenge. Oh, dude, he almost SD'd again. Falls down with an up air. And just like that, Jen's closing the gap. Yeah, Wish is not looking to make this easy, though. Not at all. Neutral air. Apply the shield pressure. Now, the thing is, Wish just hasn't gone for a roller in a quite some time. Yeah, he saw that it wasn't catching Jen. Yeah. Uh, but, could try I mean, to mix that, that could come and bite Jen. Yeah. He doesn't see it coming. He's actually been playing an inkling without roller for a while. And he now. is at that percent. No. But not to, not to kill, but to connect. But yeah. now if he gets grabbed, Jen cannot afford to get grabbed. He's it, gonna try it's to... kind of still, though. Yeah. A dash attack. Jen trying to chill high. Avoiding the grab. He is so hungry for that grab. Get, there it is. Oh, the Get the pummels. Put him is. right in the percent. Yeah, that entire. Like last 20 seconds, Wishes was just searching for a grab, and Jen finally gave it to him. He committed to a forward tilt, and that was just enough time. Wishes just go in there. Yeah, get it wasn't the grab. like it wasn't like uh, he ever had trouble with getting the grab. It was always that Jen ended up outside of the range. Yeah, <laughs> to help support your local scene. And here we go. Are we getting right into it? Pokemon trainer fighting off against Lucina. It's your boy Jackal fighting off against Roxas. Here on the other side of winter semis. Combos? Combos? Yes, sir. Okay. I guess that's it. So, uh, Lucina in this game, a very footsies based character. Once yeah. you to just try to stay out of the range, like keep, keep this uh keep your opponent away from your bubble. You don't want to play like the close range game, but you wanna bring your defensive gameplay right into your opponent. Yeah, I feel like it's Smash 4 Lucina, except with not as many inputs. Yes. And also, she greatly benefits from being able to tilt out a dash, as well as having the fastest walk speed in the game tied with Mark. Mm hmm But she doesn't need to walk. Yeah. Because she, she can wants run to, up. Unless she wants to be precise, obviously, you know? Yeah. Or commit to, like, a sandy grab. Doesn't want to commit to a fox trot. Yeah, I mean, she can trot. Uh, and her combo starter is actually either up tilt or up air, as we're seeing now. Uh, so you can just stop right in front of your opponent and just up tilt. Anyway, we got Jackal out here, rocking Pokemon Trainer, trying to get him Whoa, with the. Whoa, what was that? 
Is that is that up right here? I don't even know what is that it was. Up till Regardless, send this. sends him flying. Yeah, get get Squirtle out of here. I don't know what to expect from him. Right, Jackal's ready to go. Looking for that confirm, either a grab or a forward arrow. Run up fair, run up fair, run up fair. <laughs> he did it. But they got that low him. profile coming out from Rex's. Yeah, uh, nice. Rox's. Back air is out of shield. Yeah, I don't think. Does it again? How many back airs are you not? Ah, uh, yeah. That was that was great. Yeah, very greedy uh, fly coming out from Jackal. Trying to find his way back center stage. Heavy sore. Yeah. Back oh, wait. Air. Okay, nice. Nice. That could have been devastating for Jackal. Roxas was looking to end that second stock immediately. Tries Super to armor, you're gonna yeah. power through it. Yeah, trying to challenge Fly, not gonna work out. Get up attack. Gonna put him in a, a much better situation. Oh, dude, the Zard walk. Yeah, it's, my man's stomping on the ground. No yeah, very way. Greedy no way he really did that. Very greedy Flare Blitz coming out from Jackal. Roxas is chilling. Yeah, he's not gonna do another. He might. That's what Charizard to do. Run up there. Let's go. Double jump off the ledge with a forward air. That'll, All right, now Charizard, go away. Get out of here. You did your job. He's your holding, straight hit. He's holding on to him, dude. He believes wow. in him, but did not work out. That Great belief, Trump there. That belief was a false prophecy. Yeah, the up air combo starter. All you got to do is follow him now. Oh, you saw that? that was, and he did it again. But he got hit this time. Okay, now we're trying to play this projectile That's game. That's what I mean. Ivysaur's neutral is really good with those uh, razor leaves. Yeah. He's throwing them out there, trying to force his opponent to make a move. Or, or like, you know, I, honestly, and watch this. He's going for the parries to get in there. Yeah, Roxas. I mean, you're going to hit hit eventually. <laughs> Bad spot. Switches no, over to he's Charizard. Not, he's not done. Unless he, he is done. Perfect. Dog. Perfectly. I don't know how many times. <laughs> oh, no. We need big boy out. This guy can get hit by like a forward. Okay, we're, we're good, man. Okay, back here on top of uh, Roxas. Yeah, it's not only the Razor Leaf, it's the falling fares that lead into uh, more damage. And then the really safe bears. Okay. <laughs> I think Jack will notice that he got too close to that we're last one. a lot of Razor Leafs here. All right, we're practicing parries right now. Well, thing is, there's no re real no reason for Roxas to approach technically. He does have a pretty strong lead right now. Yeah, I mean... That's been his game plan uh, since a stock ago, and yeah. you can see it really worked out for his lead right now. He went 44%. Nah. Yeah, just catches the ledge jump with the back air, taking away game number one. Roxas with his Lucina. I won. That godlike victory thing. I don't know why Crom doesn't have it, but you know, it's whatever. <laughs> Does he not? He doesn't have that victory thing. What does he have? He has the normal fire level one, the boring one. <laughs> Damn. Because it's like Robin and Lucina both had that. They're both from the same game. Like yeah. That's the song that plays during Krom's moment. And then Krom <laughs> doesn't have it. Like, what? <laughs> Come on, ID Purpose. Like, get it together. Three, two, he has two once more. Go. Let's go. Game number two. Did he start off with Ivysaur last time? No, right? Uh, I don't Squirtle. remember. Are you character locked when you... Huh? Like, are you character locked? Like, say you win with, uh... You, you start character picks? No, 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 no. You select your Pokemon you on always, the character select screen. Yeah, but do you always select? Like, would you ever be... If you started as Squirtle and you won the game, would you have to start as Squirtle for the next one? No. no. There's no character lock. There's no character lock Smash, normally anyway. Smash doesn't have character lock. Even if there was, it, it's all one character. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. Jackal sitting at 77%. Dancing Blade, good catch from Jackal, recognizing that he was Ooh. hesitating in the middle of the Dancing Blades. Good response. The really good bear. Doesn't lead into anything, but it's just really good. Oh, okay. <laughs> good. I had brawl flashbacks. <laughs> like, did he kill himself? It's actually, I, I noticed what Jackal's been doing right now, is when, after he uses his double jump, he switches to Charizard to gain one more jump. That's yeah. really smart gameplay coming out from him. <laughs> okay, trying to just dance What are those off. wings doing? Dude, they're flapping. How many, the, how many bones? He is majestic, breaking? okay? He's awesome. Okay, 153%. Tries to fly through. Great, great tech, tech coming out from Jackal, but not, not great recovery. 
Superman has fallen. Yeah, we haven't seen a lot of Squirtle yet. Damn, he's gone. A very risky counter coming out from Roxas. Jackal's just going to respond accordingly. You know he run. We, we wanted to run off and dare. He was thinking about it. Back throw is right. I'm at 160. You could literally sneeze on it with Charizard at this point. Is that fair? I think, I think he's retired from it. Grab. Because oh. of how ready uh, Roxas is. Landing up there really good. Also, what's really good is that side tilt. I think he wants uh, Ivysaur. There's but he needs to hit him first. Yep. Oh, I, lo I love this play right now. Jackal from was Lucina. pressuring him. Oh, I mean from Lucina. Oh. From uh, Roxas. Okay, go for the but, Yeah. Okay, offstage is he gonna switch yet? No. Yeah, he's been playing Squirtle uh, really good this this switching. He's tacking on a lot of damage against Roxas. He might switch to soon for the down throw uh, Ubby. I mean, his Rock and Squirtle, dude. Yeah, he's he's doing his thing. Squirtle hasn't gotten a lot of screen time uh, this set, but he's rocking it now. Withdraw such a great option. Like, he's really rocking it now. Forward <laughs> smash catches yeah, the he's not even shield switch. option. There's no, really no reason for him to. If he's feeling confident, why as well? Yeah. Squir Squirtle doesn't get tired. Okay, now he's just chilling back. He's got the mobility that Squirtle offers. Ooh, right outside the down tilt. Yep, going to lead into damage. Ooh, not as much as uh, Jackal was expecting. Trying to go for that downer just in case. Rox is willing to retaliate. We got the neutral game again. Mm. Trying to mix him up with the empty yeah. hop grab. Hey, very, poke. very safe option. Whoa. On Falling up air to up air. We try to follow it up with oh, the vine whip as well. And we can, we can just see. <gasps> just goes for the oh, raw forward calls smash. Him out. out of a pivot. My god. What do you think happened? Like, it, it all fell apart. Jackal's adapter. It's like Squirtle wasn't a, a thing for like the first few games. But then it started working, so Jackal's like, okay, if this is going to keep working, I'm going to keep using Squirtle. Yeah, I don't and need... And the second he was put into disadvantage state, up in the air, immediate swoop to Ivysaur. Immediate switch. Yeah. The second he started figuring Squirtle out. Yeah, like the second Squirtle got hit. Like that's like Okay, uh, now you remember these? <laughs> side B, side B, side B. Oh, yes. Final destination. We got the 64 final destination coming out strong. This is when you fight Master Hand in classic mode. Pokemon Very 1999 song, ladies and gentlemen. Very 1999. All right, here we go. Three, two, it didn't play. One. I'm so confused. He forgot to hit A, I guess. I don't know. Okay. So right off the bat, Jekyll immediately pushing Roxas off stage. Ooh. Charger hole. Squirtle is out. They oh, put him away really quick. Yeah. <laughs> Get him out of here. Yep. The back airs. Try to go for a fourth. Fared right through it. Now at this point... Jackal's just putting out these active hitboxes to just force Roxas to respond. Okay. Oh, okay. Very, very good forward smash coming out from uh, Roxas. Yeah, at that point, Jackal was just watched him. What a fantastic Look. back air. Nice. Right back to, like, which character's working? Dude, he's just mixing him up constantly. Red's getting tired from swinging out those, his arms, <laughs> yeah. you know? Try to follow up after him. You know, you don't. And that was a... Uh, that was like the worst thing that could have happened. Yeah, miss input coming up from Jackal. I feel like we have yet to see a set where someone did not SD. <laughs> yeah. Oh my oh god, try to follow Lord. up with a... Looking like a forwarder. Oh no, Jackal, not please. Again. No, no, he has to jump. Okay, good. Responded accordingly. I would have panicked. The thing is, he <laughs> didn't have his jump, but he switched to Charizard to yeah, gain yeah, yeah, an yeah. additional jump. Has his second. Yeah. His third jump. Yeah, Charizard has got three jumps. Big boy out here. Old Zard walk. Oh wow, it's actually gonna poke him. Yeah, got 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 a little poked by the dolphin slash, but looks for the spike. Gets, Gets him with sour. the sour spot. Yeah, he's gonna be able to live. Toss him off. Back throw. 
Get back off the stage. Oh, I was and wondering if he's going to try that again. And now he does. One, one more grab. Oh, oh. forward air. Tried to side tilt the... Uh, dude, the, the back air, The tail in general with... It's like the claw hasn't been working, but the tail has. I mean, like, he's, like, scared of Lucina having a sword, but Charizard technically has a sword, you know? He's got, <laughs> yeah. he's got that tail. I mean, he's got a fire sword. Ooh, that was risky, but he got away with it. Squirtle, squirt. Okay, good. Down tilt just to get him off. Be a very safe option to go for. Oh, good oh, How do you know to tech? Well, honestly, like, if you're going to commit to that, like, tether grab, like, I'm already pushing R just in case. There we go. Nice. Down throw into up air, adding massive amounts of damage. Goes Just for the spike. Him. I mean, my man was going to recover off stage and low. Here's a down air spike for you. Jackal taking away game three. Yeah, this no into way a two was he air dodging that, that no, low. Not at all. It's like, I can't land on him. Boom. Because he, he has the up air. Good night. So let me go for the. Oh, you could do that. <laughs> Pokemon trainer. Potential counter pick. Zelda. Yes. Character so good. Bringing out the young Zelzel. We go back to Final Destination as well. The boy Roxas sees something in the new character, something to mix up. Now, with Phantom Knight, able to charge that up all the way, let that knight get built completely, and then it just allows Zelda to be able to kind of follow up afterwards mm -hmm. with that active hitbox. Now, at this point, Jackal's probably gonna be playing Squirtle a little bit more aggressively this time around because he wants to apply pressure. Because Zelda, Zelda gains so much from having distance. Wow, he actually got a short character like Ivysaur with uh, a jump fair. Ooh, run off into back air. Nair's going to put him back Zelda. off. I don't, yeah, that's not too contestable. Uh, the teleport to the ledge. But nice, Ooh, holding down. Up. Yeah, Rox is opting to go above the stage rather than grabbing onto the ledge to mix up Jackal's edge guarding. Mm -hmm. Good awareness. Zelda doesn't have too many uh, options at the ledge. Other than, you know, your conventional four. Did he follow that up? Was no, that he, did, he didn't get okay. hit by If he got hit by the, the knight, he would have died. The knight pushed him, though, so it made... It kept him from dying. <laughs> That's okay, got that uh, up. Be back on stage. Catches him with the toes. Is he, like, three for three with these fairs and bears? Been really strong with them, man. I mean, we've Zelda's had those since Melee, man. Uh, under the stage. Goes for the Nehru's love coming up. He actually had a pretty good response to a uh, Razor. Uh, he had good DI, but didn't trust it. Uses good the punish. quick Phantom Knight that time around, the headless Phantom Knight. That's actually pretty tricky to fastball with, the dare. I'm sure that's what he wanted to get some like up tilt follow up. Ooh. Yo, Phantom Knight looks a little bit like Shovel Knight. <laughs> just, just a little bit. You know, Shovel Knight looks like Here Phantom Knight. Here he comes. You're right. No, honestly. Yeah, I can't punish him. You oh, sure? But he gets a punish. You sure? <laughs> you <laughs> sure? Was? You sure, Joel? Like he, 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 got he it, covered he, it. He got I it. He got the punish. I'm just saying. <laughs> that smash covered so many options. Phantom is so good. There we go. Jackal just trying to apply all this pressure with these forward airs. Another one. If there's a will, there's a way. That tippy toe will catch. Your opponent. Dude, can he do this for another game though? If he does That's win the this, question. Can he... I'm gonna make it go early. Razor leave baits out the Nehru's love with the. See, forward. with this, he can play. He can play Ivysaur a lot better with the, with his reflector. Uh, but it's if if he can play neutral, Jesus. Maybe I built the wrong way. Wow, he actually gets through that Nair and challenge it, challenges it with his own. What's a good response? Oh, he's smash. reading the jump with the fine whip. Jumps over the Din's fire. Big punish into good fine yeah, whip. Yeah, he wanted the fine yeah. whip. He had to double jump away from that. Gonna respect the knight. What's the tilt? Okay. He, he's, he's nervous uh, and... Jackal didn't capitalize on it. Pick up that oh, Phantom Knight. Yeah, oh, yeah, you know, you know he was. <laughs> that was a panic option, that back roll. Yeah. He knew he was going to get grabbed. Because the thing is, what happened was Jackal rocks his. It's so good at the ledge. Swing. What's he has to go up. 
Yeah, what the, what's happening is that he's vomiting these Phantom Knights over and over, right? Uh -huh. And every single time he comes out, it's forcing... He wants Jackal to jump so that Roxas can go in there and tow him. Yeah. So that's why Jackal doesn't want to commit to the jump. That's why he's going for the back throw instead. Uh, that toe again. Neutral air. Gonna have the shield. It's the grab. That, that shield looks so small. W one more hit Next, on that like, shield. jump fair would just poke. And he's hanging on the Charizard just to stay that sixth heaviest character in the game, man. Forward smash, not gonna be able to connect. Oh, he actually misses one. Charizard is a big boy. Goes for the jab to go right straight through the spot dodge. Oh, I thought we were gonna see something crazy. And Jackal needs a power play. That was a, that was a good trade from Jackal. Back here, is he gonna go off stage? Nah. No. Comes back on. He saw how low he went. Forward tilt. Now oh! he's going off. Goes for the forward air. Sees him charge up his Phantom Knight and closes out that set with a 3 1 Punishes victory. Punishes the habit. The habit of Phantom Knight. He was waiting for it's that opportunity. It's such a good move. And that was just a reaction. He ran off. Saw it coming out. Forward air. Usually you can, a high three, my guy. You can cover that option, but he was still building. He was still... He, he, my, my man was playing Fortnite. was building his little little, yeah, uh, little, little wall, night first. The and wall wasn't up my yet. My man had a good rocket launcher and just blew it up completely. <laughs> my man forward aired him. Nice gameplay. Coming from Jack. Because that Saw was... Saw the opportunity, went for it. That was all his charts are. So good stuff. We're going to move on to the loser's side, the party side. Loser's quarters. Jen fighting off against Tilda. Now, Tilda, I know you, uh, Jewel, you're a big <laughs> fan of this Falco. I love it, dude. What do you love about the Falco, man? It's like he gets something that shouldn't lead into anything, and he, like, takes a stock. It's like Adi in a way, but with Falco. And it's not Fox, so I love it. And he's so confident in his play, too. Uh, Definitely playing on his toes. Right, there I mean, he has a bird. He's playing on his wing. You're absolutely right. What was I thinking? <laughs> I want to say they're going back and forth, but Jen definitely getting the upper hand. Ooh, parrying up to not going to do it with a weird hitbox. Yeah, still. he was trying to go for an option that would catch behind him. Yeah, it wasn't so like it was greedy. It's respectable. Yeah, very on stage. No! Was that the double dip? Yes, it was the was double that, dip. It was, was the that, patented, you're not invited to the party. Not at all. Double dip. Not invited to the party. Again. He not invited to the party, and he crashes it anyways. And he cr God, he just, uh Falco. Definitely crashed the stock. Yeah. Thing is gone. Oh. I mean, it's not care about your avocado. Follow, follow up. All right, here we go. Like, I'm always wondering when, it, when are his combos going to end? He wanted it again. Yeah, like, uh, that's when it ends, when he gets a shield grab. <laughs> Back throw to Oblivion. Up tilt in the nair. You know what's so crazy? I hated Falco in Smash 4, but I'm, I'm, loving, I'm loving this one. Like, because he was bad, or? Falco's in Smash 4? <laughs> yeah, that's what I was, I was actually going to ask I hated thing. playing Falco, playing against Falco. How'd you unlock him? <laughs> it's right, like, you go. gotta go subspace. Ooh! Oh, okay. Jen, Jen is pissed. He's yeah. he's up there. <laughs> he was mad. He said, I know you're going My man for is this. fuming. All right, Jen gets back onto the stage. Oh, Jen I thought the double dip, attack. but what? too high. Wow, walk? the hardest read. The walk? Oh, uh, like smash four habits. See, that side beat happened coming Happened again. You can shield and Fox will... I mean, that's the thing. That's been a thing since, like, you know, for like 17 years, we've been doing the whole punish behind yeah. the shield. Since before Jen was born, we've been, uh, we've been doing that. Yeah, he grew up with he it. He grew up with it. He was molded by it. So to have to break that muscle memory, that's that's tough. Yeah. Imagine it's it's the intentional mix-up. Yeah. That I know you've been... A Sakurai <laughs> implant. Yeah. The second people started like uh, adapting to it, Sakurai's going to be like, actually, the new patch, you'll go through with the shield. <laughs> that's how Sakurai sounds, apparently. I don't know. That was a terrible impersonation. All right, we got that back door ready to go. There it nice. is. Nice. Just, I'm not going to deal with your hitboxes. Mm -hmm. Here's this bear. And Jen holding on to this stock like a champ. Yeah. Never mind. It's gone. Good night. <laughs> I have a bear, too. Dude, but he was already riding his will. Back air. Into uh, yeah, another that, shield. Yep. That's actually a true combo. Shield the shield. Sense. Yeah, shield the shield. And looking like... Uh, out. Not going to lead into any, anything at these percents, but... Gonna hurt. The slowest Fox Illusion combo. <laughs> yeah. 
It's still sitting at 90%. He made him air made dodge into the ground. Oh, stop it! Okay. What is he okay. doing? That Who is he? Stack it up. Stack it up, dog. <laughs> and and now we're at an even game. Down tilt into forward air. Not, yeah. no, super, no sweet spot. Catches the ri very risky Fox illusion. That was the first time you see Tilda trying to recover high this time around. But yeah. because Jen just reacted to it simply, the up smash was winning with his name on it. He might have wanted to do it uh, lower so he can, you know, shield on the platform. Right. But it was just too high. Jen reaction too fast, and that's going to lead to the end of the game. So now we're thinking about some counter picks here. Uh, he's going over what stages he wants to ban. Yoshi's Isle? Yoshi's Story? A Yoshi? Are we actually going to see Yoshi's Story? Yeah, so this is like, I actually, I'm, I'm a big fan of this stage because it's like Battlefield, but it's like bigger. Like the map itself is bigger and, and the, the blast, blast zones are smaller. So it, it, it's very unique in that regard because you, you can just tell like right off the bat, like the middle of the stage just seems super big. Like you can't even see the top platform in the, for the opening shot compared to Battlefield, you mm -hmm. know? All right, just gonna wait. Yeah, he just double jump. Good nice. air dodge. He had to. If he didn't commit to that air dodge, he was dead. That that air dodge was so melee, by yeah. the way. 100%. Hey, neutral oh. out of dash. Even smacks him with the shield to boot. Just goes like, Ugh. Dude, up till it's so scary to get hit by. Dude, Falco sounds so painful when he gets hit. Oh, no. Oh. No. The, the, okay, the, he's not gonna dip. I mean, he dipped, but he didn't double. Yeah. He was respectable this time. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, the wall jump to try to mix up when he's going to go, Jen did not budge. Mm -hmm. We're this still was, watching him. This is why this could be a, a good counter pick for Falco. Or anyone that has a wall jump in general is that Yoshi's Story offers just a wall. Offset. Yeah. Allows you to jump off of it, mix up how you get back to the stage. So the recovery. You get spiked, you can tech. Mm -hmm. Jairus gets the oh. explosive flame. Air dodges right into it. He got it. scared by the spark, tried to beat it out. Oh, off stage with the laser. Uh, a little bit too close to the wall, but commits the one back air. will eventually seal the deal. SpongeBob ass <laughs> song. Nice air dodge. Up oh, airs right through the shield. <laughs> he's swinging. Oh, and he's swinging for a reason. Covered the jump. Oh, thanks. Dunks him back into the platform. Do you think he can still get the double dip on this stage? Oh, yeah. Like at the ledge? Oh, 100%. Because the platform's like right there. It, it is kind of like awkward off there. Like you said, it's near the edge. But if he short hops it. Whoa. Oh, uh, nice. tilt. Really, really good air, air dodge. Catches him shielding. He's off stage once more. Tries to go for the down tilt. Good That's challenge. So so, Falco just wants to do the splits real quick off that forwarder. Gonna respect Jen, but not enough. The thing is, he committed to the air dodge really early, yeah. so he could not use a second air dodge while off stage. Yeah, so it was an easy hit for him. Yeah, Jen. I figured he'd go to the ledge. It seemed like he tried to go higher. Catch oh, the there, jump. real scary. Oh, oh dude! What man, wall jumping into a back air. Come Jen. on, that's why I picked this stage. That's okay. We got no smash with his name on it. All right, are we going back to the party though? We'll see. We'll see if Falcon gets an invite this time around. Or if Joker's gonna steal it. <laughs> oh, he got the up tilt combos. Oh! He wanted I it. Didn't he follow that. He was one. definitely thinking about it. Yeah, he saw the the way the platforms are set. He knew he'd be able to fall on the, the top plat and get more off of it. Ooh, good forward tilt, catching the spot dodge. Ooh, right past it. Ooh, Dude, that's it. his primary punish tool. The up tilt? Yeah. <gasps> it puts him into the air. You know, that's exactly what Falco wants. Falco wants his opponent in the air. He's getting a lot of sour spots. Good cancel with that warp. Catches the tech. I respect that auto reticle. Yeah. Oh, he made the air dodge super quick. He did not mean to go on stage. Empty hop. Till they mix him up as well with that empty hop. And, and he goes grab. so high with his second jump. Yep. Oh, Ooh, he's got a jet. You hear him? He's leaving the party. He's <laughs> out of here. He's done. He's that cool kid that's got to go to the next party. The after after party. <laughs> got a jet. Well, thing is, Falco has the highest jump in the game. Like, he literally, like, out of any character in this game, yeah. he can jump the highest. So after that up throw, you're, you're, you're damn tootin'. He can get you're up like there right next to a him. blast zone that he can, like, fly to. He will, so. get, up. He will get up there. He will find a way. He uh, is a bird. He will fly up there. Poisonally. 
He prefers the self tilt. <laughs> He does. He oh my really, god, he, he tried, really does. Jen tried to punish the other. Is that plus a block hello? I don't know, but it, it's ridiculous. It, it like leads into like every move in the air. <sighs> Including itself. Oh, okay. Oh, oh all, all right. Are those crouches coming out? Yo, let's go. My, my man is moving. My man's like, I, I'm playing online, all right, so he's, I can't he's talk. He's actually dead. Like, oh. you, if he got spiked, he would have deserved it. And I Jen, wouldn't have been mad. Jen has gotten three of the, has whiffed three of those down airs off of the Firebird. I just want to say, Jen, learn to back off the ledge without hitting down so you don't fast fall into down there, and then that'll be easier, potentially. Taking notes out here. Cheating. My man, my man, Devin coming in with Yo, a coach. Is, this guy is a nut. <laughs> he's still F smashing. Covering the, the air dodge with the F tilt. Which I still don't like. I still think the F tilt's bad. He's but. out of jumps. Fuck! He had to go for the Firefox. <laughs> Neutral there's the out of the shield option. Parry, no follow up. Back air retreat. They were they were testing each other with the back airs. Spacing each other out. It's only a matter of time. I love the chase. People will try to get out of the combo. Uh, and while he's ready to continue the combo, he's also ready to, you know, restart it. Oh, we're down. Yeah, takes him back down. Tosses him just to dunk him back down. And then we're up. Yeah. That's a cool, I've never seen that. I'm, I'm smart. That's a cool animation. It's not like foxes, you know? Does it still hit from behind? I'll <laughs> ask him. Ask Falco. Nice catch. I mean, really nice catch. the thing is, still they had to go for that air dodge, or else he's going to commit to that firebird, which Jen could easily capitalize on. Uh, yeah. Oh, Let's see if he can snap the ledge and back air is going to take it full stock ahead. Uh, and I'm expecting some crazy stuff. Let's try to back air through that new tilt. <laughs> I even do that. Ooh. Air dodged in again. Back air. Ooh, good follow up with that Fox illusion, uh, punishing the whiffed tech. Another tomahawk. Hey, he's not making this this stock easy. Not at all. Dude, he's he, to call is, out a roll. he is wild. He wanted to call out that roll so He probably hard. has like a brother he plays that rolls a lot. <laughs> he's like, yo, here comes my forward smash, young Timmy. <laughs> he's got a nephew or a niece. Oh, to get Tommy, away. why? My man's coming back. He has to to yes, Can we does. please get this down? He has to go against. Oh, yeah. Jen. Well, it was either he went straight up or he hit, hit the stage. So it was like late or early, yeah. and Jen went for early. Uh, Tilda went for late. Mixing them up with these 50 50s. Oh, talk about mix ups. That was not optimal DI, but you can't really blame him. And uh, Jen's sitting at high percent, literally one grab away from potentially dying. Or an up tilt. Any, anything to get him airborne, you know? I mean, we've seen, we've seen clutch today time and time again. <laughs> we Challenges. See it's a parry, no grab. Jesus, He's getting crossed up. The perfect shield just oh, doesn't. It's not gonna do it. The perfect shield just doesn't work out when like they cross you up, you know. Nice. Empty hop puts him into the air. Look at him follow. Like, back well, on like the what's stage. the play here? Legend is he just gonna? Apparently. Is he gonna just space bears? Up to looking like it's gonna kill soon. Yeah, literally at this point, Falco could just like lightly touch her, and she'll explode. Seems like he's missing all Punish. the uh, He wasn't ready for it, but react to it. Back air gonna the grab. Now not to get do the kill. Falco's a little bit heavier. Oh, he panicked. It looked like Jen had an opportunity. Oh, he does again. Is that going to do it? Show off your thing. You see her do that back throw? No, no, one, no one, one can hide from this light dog. Look see at how this. dark it is? Oh, no. It yeah, it's like, it's like uh, Yo, do your thing. She did the splits midair. Back from the light. Caught it. Good thing there's no camera be underneath that dress, man. Because like, like, she was, uh, oof. Got the back throw. Let's go. Let's go. So we got clutch. ourselves a game. Game three. He tossed him aside. Game four, actually. Two to one in Jen's paper. Back to FD. Yeah, right back. Gonna have to configure some more music on these stages. I know there's like 30 songs that we could be listening to. Up tilt her out. Well, you know when you select a song and you just keep going back, it just oh, keeps that song selected. Oh, no. Is that what they did? I mean, the game does that. Yeah, but the second you pick another, another stage, that resets. Yeah, but they Maybe went from FD to FD. You're right. You're you know, right. on, on home councils, it's really good. Yeah. The home council. The home council. 
The councils, we don't bring the Xeno. <laughs> the councils. Here we go. 19 to 47. All right, Dilly's looking for that opening. This is the roll on stage. He's still just jumping into the air. Jump for joy, my guy. The Falco's jump just... My man is like on a trampoline or something. Look at that back air. Goes for the punish. Uh, scoops back him up air, with the up tilt. Gonna cover both the air dodge and the he was still going he for the back airs down there. That was really greedy, extremely greedy, and Jen's yeah. gonna capitalize on that hard. Finally getting the down air spike. Yeah, Jen, Jen knows uh, he's crazy. He's been trying to hide it, but yeah. we, we could tell. Like, like the craziness is slowly coming out as like the set progressively. Yeah progresses it's like i shouldn't go for this but yeah but i'm feeling it <laughs> <laughs> but i prefer the air <laughs> for the hey. blast zone to keep playing like that yeah honestly back throws him off stage 74 percent as we go into the twilight zone covers it completely yo he wants a response dance around that shield oh punishes the forward till the very last second i'm gonna that. do it though Jen just rolls on stage. That was a free grab. It was a miss input, and he panicked, uh, but got away with it. Okay, punishes the dash grab with the spot dodge into a jab. It tries to go for the oh, trump. Gets trumped oh himself. As air dodge through. Yeah, that was almost it. Good nice. challenge. Okay. Tilde knowing that Jen recognized that he had his air dodge gone, was going to go off there. Challenges yeah. him with an up air. Smart stuff. 147% potential edge guard for Jen. Oh, he was spacing out those this back airs. Oh. oh, smash! Dude, Bring that, up the with The same situation, but reversed this game. That's falling forward air. And we have Ooh. the combos. They're out. 66. He, he shouldn't neutral get up. Nice. You saw he was going for the double yeah. loop. Jen tried to follow up the, another neutral air, but then not enough damage to actually connect. Down smash. Lifts the grab. Oh, no. Crosses him up. Up tilt into fair. Really good stock so far by Tilda. That pivot grab coming out. Yeah, he's not going to fall for too many more uh, but tomahawks. Jen is hounding him, though. He's yeah. following him. He's going like to go low. Good he's planning off. on it. Yeah. Good jab. Get some off stage. Tilda's looking for a back air. Get goes for the grab instead. Nice. Jen now cognizant of... Uh, the grab follow-ups. The throw follow-ups. Also cognizant of that. He used his jump. Sad he used his jump. Good punish. That's really going to kill him? No way. Fire. Tries to get the spike. Not going to happen until he's still in this fight. Yeah. 109%. Jen can't be too upset about it. Oh, he's in I a bad that was a spot. Spike. Good nice. night. Jen going deep for that final kill. Yeah, it's a lot of crazy stuff happening in that uh, set. But Jen going to... You know, not get too rattled by really anything. Closes it out with a two-stock victory, and three to one is going to move on to losers semis. I thought, semis. like, in the spirit of clutchness this tournament, we were going to see something crazy. But uh, Jen playing too solid. That was really there's a good lot of, There's a lot of clutch. You just can't. Just skip over it. Here we go. Pokemon Stadium 2. Fox versus Lucina. Oh, that's not healthy. Whoops. <laughs> not at all. I that saw is, the uh, plaid shirt, and I'm like, that's Ralphie. <laughs> is that not? It's no. That's your boy, uh, Roxas. Oh. And they got to yeah. swap it, too. Yeah, Odyssey fighting off against Roxas. Uh, the, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah Audi re representing Fox. Lucina representing by Roxas himself. Here we go. This is a matchup we are no strangers to from the previous game. We saw this a lot at the Xenos. Yeah, this Mr. is going to e be. Mr. E versus, like, Audi or yeah. Lights. But in this game, because of edge guarding, super buffed, uh, Lucina's air edge guarding is in. All right, here we go. Okay. Wait, what's up? No, no, no. no. It was just... It's it's literally gonna be him tossing him off stage, or it should be him tossing him off stage. Like the percents right now, Adi's favor. But Adi's favor. You gotta kill Fox early. Very important. Just like just snuff out that lead before he even gets a chance to get Bill Lance. I'm going. Yeah. Nice pivot grab. Yeah. Even though, like, pivot grab kind of sucks. The pivot grabs are way un more unsafe in this game because you can't pass through people. But if you yeah. catch them jumping, it's actually a smart option. Because it's a slight, it's a little safer than dash grab. Mm -hmm. Ever so slightly. He's not going off stage for you. My man is keeping his feet on the ground. Wow. 
Is that laser? I feel like he tried to do something out of shield, but forgot like how laggy it is. Okay. Do Don't I say this is even? Uh, but Lucina needs one advantage stage. Oh, Toss dancing. him off stage once. And he is done for. Uh, but Adi's where he wants to be right now. That said. You're trying to apply pressure with that back air? Yeah, I tried to catch it. He, I feel like he sees it every time. Like, maybe he's hitting the inputs too fast, and he's not getting them all. Woo! Ferret. Oh. I was going to say it's not enough to keep him out, but it seems like it's working now, along with the Dancing Blade. Yeah, if you keep... Oh, my lord, that Dolphin Slash coming in, just stage spiking Audi completely. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, we'll see how far he goes with this. Or say anything. Yeah, up till it's all she needs. Nice, that dude. That was slick. Just turning around that Dancing Blade. Oh, uh, wide open. Very greedy Dolphin Slash out of shield. It's a pretty good burst option, but that little percent, you're not going to really do too much. He's like, he's going to tomahawk me. Let me throw yeah. out this quick hitbox. Uh, you know, Roxas is trying to bait it out. Jump his option to go for these jumps. Audi looking for some damage himself. Set a spot in there. Good stuff. No, oh, last stock's for both of them. Ooh, good trade. Now, if Roxas can keep... You know, playing the slow game. Don't let Fox speed up the match. He could just, you know, take it take it home. Yeah, just keep him at a sword's length distance. That's all you got to really do. really want to win this one, uh, considering the SD. You're not going to, you're probably not going to get another one. Yeah. I say probably, like, <laughs> very much intentionally. Dolphin Slash goes back on stage. Audi's got yeah, pressure. Oh, nice job not rolling. Uh, he's definitely fishing it out. The stage presence coming out from Adi, my oh, god. Oh, it looked like he survived it, but jump doesn't really help you. You need the directional air dodge. That's right. Blessing. Like, the second that he was off stage the very first time, Adi was just continuously bringing out all those back airs and he was just not letting him get any sort of stage control. Really, he was playing his, he's playing his game the whole, the whole match. Uh, only with that, S, at that SD was it close. Are you serious? Richter Belmont. Well, this is going to be fun. Did not believe in Lucina. I don't appreciate how they gave Richter my arc fire. I'll say. So, Richter Belmont, similar to Simon Belmont, has a lot of projectiles. Oh, yeah, in one ways. In every way possible, except for their fire is a different color, which affects red Pikmin against Olivar. Really? Yeah. Well, what about we, the blue one? Uh, nope. Nothing. <laughs> Richter is better, better. Richter is technically better than Simon, just because uh, his holy water can work against all of our. That's so stupid. Yeah. Because he's using holy water. Simon yeah. just throws a bick. You're right. Like. You're absolutely right. But yeah, Richter definitely a projectile-based character. Wants to keep, wants to keep Fox out even further away. Uh, but not doing okay. that at all. Yeah, not at all. He gets really pressured hardcore. But the second Roxas gets Audi off stage, you, you'll see those projectiles coming his way. He also got tons of range on that whip. Forward tilt, forward airs, back airs. Oh, I want to say that their they're bears and fares are different. Yep. Uh, Simon and Belmont. They are not. Them. Not at all. I've, I've exactly heard. the same. I've, I've, heard. I've lived it myself. They do the exact amount really? of damage, the exact amount of knockback. All right, I'd like yep. to take that back. Yeah. Cool. Because yeah, I, I kept hearing that too. So I went to the lobby and I was, screw it, I'm going to freaking lab this. They do exactly the same. Damn liars. Yeah. That's why I don't believe the internet ever. Like the holy water thing that, that was spreading from DeBuzz. I was like, I'm going to go lab this. I labbed it with John. <laughs> like, oh my god. It actually does happen. All right, here we go. Back throw. It's looking like with this advantage state, we're going to see a lap in percents. And Good. There oh, it is. that forward tilt. Yeah, Richter's just having some trouble. Finally getting, this, uh, getting out, but no, Audi's back in. This is looking like a tiresome matchup for Roxas, man. Yeah. Like, it, like, Fox just, like, breaks his zone so hard. I feel like you gotta put so much time into this character to, like, really know how his... Not that he has a meta, but... <laughs> it is week one, mind you. <laughs> All right, here we go. Gets the back off stage. Now, the thing is, another reason why this matchup might not be the best is Fox has a reflector. That negates a lot. You have a reflector. 
Frosty just said I it. I just said it, dog. I oh, whatever. Just in case. Audi maybe thought that it was Smash 4 again, could just air dodge that Firefox, yeah. but no. Remember what I said about SDs? I yeah. said probably. Probably. Yeah. But that was a good bait. If that was any other character, there they'd goes. have to go for the air dodge or die, so I get it. Yeah. Fox does have an option. I mean, even if he goes for the shine, he might just fall to his death regardless, but it's worth a shot. All right, here we go. Down throw has about 1-818%. Down tilt to up air. I was going nice. to say the dash attack is so good, but it didn't hit, like, at all. <laughs> Take what? Take what, Tell dude. me what, Richter. Take this back air. Oh, I'm my God. Back. He was going. He was dead. He was actually dead, but Not yet. <laughs> Audi went too deep. The Belmont survive. But just, just toss him. Or just shield Dude, poke him. Right. My man, like, Richter. What, what were you supposed to do, though? Rock, uh, switch character. Like, honestly, that looks brutal. That looks so brutal. Like, never again. Don't bring that character out against Fox, of all characters. All right, here we go. Rox is coming up with the counter pick. You're going to see the Lucina again? Honestly, like, I, I get why he went to Richter. Richter could be a secondary. He just wasn't feeling Lucina. But Richter just did not work, so we're going straight back to Lucina. With Lucina, I feel she's really good, but your opponent always knows what Lucina wants. I always like, know what Fox wants. Fox yeah, wants but sometimes it just doesn't matter. <laughs> You're right. I missed this stage, dog. I'm getting nostalgic yeah. and all everything from Brawl. Like, I miss the ghost, but I get why the ghost is turned off. Okay. The other thing that comes up? On yeah, the, the, the ghosts that come up just randomly. Oh, it's off? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's hazardous. It should be off. It honestly should be off. Those are Ooh, hype. And, uh, where are you, you know going? what else is hype? Catching Firefox where with a spike. Where are you going, uh, Fox, Audi? Is that still as hard? That spike? I'm sorry? The, the one frame spike? I'm not sure thing. if it's one frame anymore. People were telling me that it's more than one. I have yet to lab it. Feels easier, oh you know? god, you're dead! Shine spike! Is he actually out here with these shine spikes? Yeah, dude, it actually is strong as heck in this game. You know what I want to Nintendo's wanted... like, oh, you like shine spikes, do ya? From Melee. Oh, well, we got you. I wanted to see Adi versus uh, Tilda. That'll be a hoot and a holler. But let's see if Roxas can try to, like, change the course of history. That is Lucina's purpose. <laughs> yeah, like. Whoop! See that dash up jab? Okay, push him off. Oh, he's just playing patient. Catches the up air. How do you think the slant affects uh, ledge trapping on this stage? It depends on the character, honestly. In my opinion, I feel like it doesn't really affect Fox too much, yeah. but like other characters, like characters that have like really strong down tilts that need to like go a certain way. No Hello. way! It's the that's the classic. The dog. best thing about that is that was so true. He couldn't take a damn yeah. thing. It was so true that uh, the freaking Roxas could have had a cup of tea when that forward <laughs> smash came out. He could charge it a little bit farther. Ooh, try to mix him up with the Dolphin Slash. Nope. You no see his mash face when he's, when he's pummeling? I he couldn't mash out. Let's be honest. This game is I've seen people stupid. mash out, dog. Have you seen the kill stages mash nice out? Nice like, down he, he can get out. All right, 132. Misses up the uh, fourth swing. Oh, I love the forward throw now. Okay, whipping that forward smash, forward tilt, pushes him off, catches him really? with no. the forward air. Not enough to get that kill just yet, even though we saw sparks fly. Yeah, I missed that spike. one. This is a really weird angle. If he got that one, he would have been a god. I forgot you can angle it. What? Uh, Double trade. jump was gone. Trade with uh, Sour Nair. Just go for the back air, yeah. whatever. Rox is finally putting a point on the board, and now he has breathed some life into this character. Yes. I think you really need. Oh, it. this victory theme gives me goosebumps every time. Every time I get goosebumps, I'm I'm about to just pick up Lucina just for that victory theme, dog. <laughs> ah, it's so good. All right, here we go. Game. Wait, didn't they didn't four. select the music? No. Nah. We go into random. We go into shuffle music. No way. Bring it on. Going back to Pokemon Sun and Moon. Okay, they're just... No one wants to commit yet. Killing each other out. Yeah, and Pokemon Sun 2 is a pretty big stage, so... Gives you plenty of yeah. room to run around. Yeah. 
Ooh. Trying to get that back air down throw into up air. Okay. Yeah, I thought he was going to get more out, out of it. I mean, something from the... That's the most frustrating thing when you have a combo going and they just fall with an air. Yeah. And I'm like, well, damn it. And Dolphin Slash is a great combo breaker. It's a very quick move and has some iframes on it, you know? Mm hmm. On startup. Oh, yeah, I'll still Good try follow. to get. Definitely was looking for that second dump tilt. Man, you hear that smack that comes out when Fox lands down tilt? Just smack I got it. I got it. I'm, I'm mostly looking for the. Uh, his pummels, his face when he pummels. Oh, yeah, but, yeah. But you have when to you, look, like, you just hold He is into it, yeah. dude. <laughs> He's as into it as uh, when you grab the bag. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, now we get back on stage. Gets the ledge jump read. Back air coming your way soon from a fox near you. <laughs> Down air. Oh, that's still so good. He went for a forward smash. My man was like, you're going to air dodge, sucker. Get 127, fire foxes back onto the stage. He seemed to be ready for the roll-in, but assumed the second hit of Nair would cover it. You know what's making me mad? Adi is playing Smash 4 Fox. The second he tried to escape with Fox Illusion, well, he got away with it, but... He's playing Smash 4 Fox with uh, Melee Fox Shine. And, and Ultimate Side B. We got the, the hybrid. Yeah. I mean, that's not good. <laughs> the, the last one. Yeah, we don't want nothing for Brawl. Get that Brawl Fox out of here. Ooh. Dolphin Slash is back on stage. Tries to get him with the back air, but we got some low profile action coming out from really, Lucina. Really good uh, footsies from Audi. Okay. I mean, I'd like to see more from uh, Roxas, but I guess he understands that, you know, I don't want to get lasered, so I'm going to keep jumping. And if oh, you yeah. pull out the gun. Pull out this up tilt into back air. That still works. Works since 2014. Ah, yeah. He tried to... You get back in this, but you're gonna have to work Ooh. a little harder. Challenging with a forward air for maximum damage. A lot of neutral, neutral specials. Audi's one sock away for moving on to loser semis. Before we see our final four competitors, who's it gonna be? Look, it's looking like Adi right now if he keeps yeah, playing honestly, solid as solid yeah. as he is. He is at high percent, mind you, so Roxas could easily close out this stock. He gets one good read. Here we go. Try to get a two frame with the down tilt. Doing a lot Real of retreating defensive. Forwarders. He doesn't want to take another percent before he gets the stock. So I go for that uh, back air off the platform. Oh, we're falling too low. No capitalization from Adi. He wasn't ready for it. Going to oh, yeah. take another 20. Yeah, Roxas needs to close out the stock right now if he wants a chance of taking yeah, the stock. Yeah, Adi five. understands that. That's the thing with, uh, with Lucina. That's what I was talking about. It's like... Like, if your opponent knows what you're going for, it just makes it harder. Yeah, Naughty's not approaching, like you said. He is chilling back, lasering, waiting for Roxas to get antsy, punishing his approach. Got a little bit too close to stop yeah. by the forward tilt. Naughty's sitting at 162%. He tried to catch the, the neutral getup. He read it, but he's afraid to commit to anything because he doesn't want to take more percent, but it keeps happening. Yup. Yeah, that, I mean, even if Adi loses his stock at this point, like he just did, like he has tacked on so much damage to Roxas. He finally committed to something, yeah. which was, you know, the fair. Overshot. It goes for the down throw. But, I mean, is it too little, too late? At this point, Adi could be looking for a sour spot in there into up smash. Mm-hmm. There it is. Oh, what? Didn't believe in it. Yeah, he's not too upset by it. Okay, Rox is coming in, just mashing that side B. Catches still him playing. swinging. He was still playing safe. He was still trying to play safe when he had to, like, he got the the side B, got the dancing blade, pressing. You see, he's just waiting. Yeah, he waited for that forward tilt, and Adi's like, I see my opportunity. Here is a back air coming yeah. to your back. Over the world. You know, we got some Japanese players coming by. We got uh, California coming through, Void, Tweak. I think Larry Lurr might be trying to come out. We'll see, but let's Big jump into this game. Least. Winners finals, Wishes versus Jackal. Kind of a... Did not expect to see this as our winners finals, to be on TBH. Didn't they see this before? Like, didn't they play in uh, Grands? That was a different America? Pokemon trainer. Hmm. Regardless, let's get into it. Wishes rocking the Splatoon character, Inkling. 
Oh, I thought we were going to see some nasty jab block stuff. Could you imagine? I mean, I don't have to. They've done it <laughs> in this, this very tournament. Okay, Wishes is Spark. jumping back onto that stage. We see him moving. Oh, it goes for the like, withdrawal yeah. midair. That's a, that's a to, pretty safe move, honestly. Yeah, it's a land. Oh, Whoa, there, there's okay, the so that beats Catches that. the breakout. That was smart. Didn't catch the DI, though. Yeah, yeah. Come with the sour spot of up smash. Trying to go off deep. Oh! Whoa. He bet it all. Jackal capitalizing That's what I'm on saying. You, you just got to challenge Inkling off stage. But you know, she's just coming back with an up air. She's herself. pissed. You saw that? Oh, yeah. Man's getting uh, bum rushed out here. Forward tilt. Just spam it. They're out. Yeah, get that ink. Squirtle looking like a shiny out here. You okay, got that back air. Applying some pressure to the shield. All right, try to uh, chase him. He was trying to get that uh, tech read. Yeah, Hoping that he was going to go left, you know? Yeah. So, recognize he couldn't get anything uh, true after that. I'm going to back off. We might see the Ivysaur if he gets if he gets put in disadvantage. Wait. Cold it. So, my man is out here moving. Oh, here we go. Yeah, wait, for wait, real. Wait. Which is that 88% connects into Razor the Vine Dude. Hello? Dude, what the? Damn. What Genius move is that, actually? That was forward smash. No, I mean, like, like takedown? Oh, oh, no. you, oh, you mean, like, well, you know, some days. I know what move that was. SD. Yeah, dude. My man actually used Should've it. Said no, that, honestly, wait, that was Honestly, it was explosion coming from Voltorb. I missed an, an opportunity. It's okay, man. There's literally a move called. Yeah, I'll do it again. You, you'll, you'll catch it next time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll see another one. There we go. Down throw into neutral air. Easy damage. Ah, he's, he's following him. It's so painful to hear Ivysaur get hurt. Oh, yeah. They're just trying their best, you know? Protect plant dog. <laughs> really? That's what he is? The plant dog? God. <laughs> That's how aggressive that grab was. He just charged him, dude. Now we got Wishes at super low ink. Oh, no. Right Wish. idea, though. Yeah. Wow, that back air hits him so well. That was good stuff from Wishes. Charging his ink just enough to get the splat grenade out. Mm -hmm. Nice thing at 138%. Good job jumping. Squirtle ready to go. Forward airs him out of the down air. Holding that shield. Mm, try to catch the landing. Neutral air. Ooh, nice. He thought the bomb was exactly where Ivy would be if he had latched onto the ledge mm. to switch to Charizard. Uh, but what do you do at the ledge with Charizard? It can be tough. He's oh, jumping. Accidental? Really good jumps. This could be big. Plat, get out of here. No. Still living. 127%. So much room up there. Oh, he was going for a roll read. Yeah, I thought we were going to see another grab. Are we going to see another grab? Forward air. Big that was boy bad Charizard. Six heaviest in the game. We still living out here. Oh, we let go of shield. That back air coming out. Maybe you tried to. That game one. You think you tried to parry? He might even try to parry or just do anything out of shield. And uh, that was, uh, that's that. The game one, going to your boy, Wishes Inkling. As we jump into game numero dos. You know, I at first, I got sick of this song, right? I think it's only because of, what, of my home console. When I'm, when I'm like home playing this game, I get sick of this menu theme. I'm so antsy to unlock menu music. But at a tournament? It feels nice because it just like jumps back into that opera. That, I'm not that, sick or, of it yet. Yeah, I'm so, sick of it at home, but at tournaments, I'm not sick of it. If that makes any sense. I can see that. All right, here we go. Get that rapid jab, putting some ink on Squirtle, lowering that defense. Rapid jab is <laughs> such a good tool for just adding on not only damage, but to also lower the defense of your foe. Mm -hmm. Okay, catches him trying to dash away. I was he was at too low percent for that yeah. to follow up. Yeah. 
A real question, even for even for wishes, uh, as to what he could follow up with at those percent. Uh, just like a quick dash attack, honestly. Just go for your yeah. quickest burst option. Just attack on damage. Okay, Spy Grenade goes through Razor Leaf. Interesting. Could be a meta development for himself. The angles on the, the Vine Whips don't seem that big a deal, but the hitbox really is. The differences. Yeah, it's strong. It covers a lot of options, you know. Okay, so we're doing a low underhand throw. Ivy sort of struggling yeah, to find his way back. He's really the just trying to fight his way out of the corner, and uh, wishes is inviting. Yeah, and he got waiting the, for the confirm. The classic booyah combo coming out, up throw to up air. I'm just gonna hold shield. Withdrawal is pretty safe on shield. Yes. Like I said, if you see a squirrel withdrawing at you, you just gotta just, go for a, jump. a multi hit or just jump on top of him. Like a flamethrower, honestly, from Charizard, flamethrower would be a good option against him. But but like that's his man. That's his man. So it's not you know we're not gonna see that. I like to see him maybe like go for like. Yeah, oh. that's that DIN. Oh, just go. I love Ivysaur's dash attack animation. He just like bum rushes you, you know. <laughs> and he slides he after. Shoulder tackles. That's like what he, it is. He it's really puts all tackle. of it into into the one attack. Oh yeah. He's just giving his. Ivysaur's giving him his all. Oh. Yeah. Jackal seeing how much he can get from the one. Ah, uh, but now he's in disadvantage. Slide down that ink. Yeah, slower in the center of the stage. Jab out of. Ooh, really good movement. Ivy Swords here. Trying to get that follow up off the air dodge, but Wish is pushing Jekyll back off. Trying to get that follow up with the grab as well. Yeah, the rollers are just not connecting. And I really appreciate that we're not getting hit by rollers. Oh, yeah. We're, we're adapting, you know. It's it was still, it was very good, a very good tool week one. But now we're technically starting week two, so yeah. Charizard. Okay, okay back. No, make it. that vine whip will make it, but it's not gonna be able to defeat that forward air man. Something Charizard wouldn't have died to that. Uh, yeah, you're right. But here comes a grab. <laughs> <laughs> he went for it. <laughs> he went for an up smash afterwards. <laughs> Rapid jab, add on that defense down. Debuff. Shiny Squirtle back. Yeah, he's <laughs> real all, shiny. Real shiny, like. How many times are you gonna yeah, eat that it, bro? Like, hello. Just give him some red cheeks. All right, I thought we were gonna see an up tilt, but. Oh. Yeah, we're getting we're getting some percent. Is he gonna? Yeah. It's like a shine stall in the air, but with iframes. Yeah. Oh, challenges him with a forward smash. Good trade for Jackal. Good try out of shield. Good burst option. Oh, Tries yeah. to spike him out of the super jump. Still and ready. Sit. Yeah. Goes for Charizard to recover after using Vine Whip. Smart stuff. You think he meant to face that way? Uh, Maybe I mean, he went he for the did. kill. He was trying to go for the kill with the Vine Whip, but mm -hmm. then he had Charizard as a counter pick to come back to the stage. Gets caught by the Slosher. What? That must have been the higher percent, less invincibility. Yo, nerf Slosher in Splatoon 2, dog. That move is OD. I think I think that move actually got nerfed from early Splatoon 2 meta, but still. Going We're back. going right back. PS2. No, it's well. Pokemon Look how long he was on this. Oh, it must have been the tether. He didn't have a. You can't hang on he, as he was long. Hang, his iframes wore off a, for a long time. So, you know, you got your boy. Uh, He's just going to be like, well, I mean, Jackal, if you're going to chill down there for that long, I'm just going to go for a down smash. It wasn't that long. It was long enough. Yeah. And that's what counts. Wishes, wishes think so. There we go. Gets the uh, Booyah combo to rack up some damage. With the platform. It's a jab afterwards. Ooh, yeah. He was waiting for the late recovery. Look at that karate dude, jump. Yeah. Dude, I've never <laughs> I seen that. Let's say. go. Super jump. Gets caught by the uh, waterfall. waterfall. Parry into forward really tilt. Parry. Oh, and he's continuing they the combo. It's like, oh, oh my no. good lord. Ivysaur is the dunk master. Yeah, 100%. Well, I mean, Falco Ivysaur, is the dunk master. Ivysaur, then, so I like to call Ivysaur a female because of the bulb that she exposes when she does like up smash and stuff. But I think she is definitely a dunk master. She will grab an opponent and throw him in the trash can. 100%. But we don't know what gender she is. The bulb? 
You got it. It's on yes. both genders. The seed is exposed only on Ivysaur. Whatever. Stop spreading your My lies. head cannon is that she is a female. <gasps> <Ow>. <laughs> Whatever. I'm going to go and eat some food. Anyways, I'll see you guys. <laughs> okay, 124%. Uh, meanwhile, uh, Wish is having some trouble taking the stock away. And now we have uh, Big Man on the yeah, stage. Yeah, Big Man, Ivysaur Grab will no longer connect at this point. Oh, not even on Big Man? Not oh, on Big Man, wow. Up what was that? Into up smash. That was a uh, air dodge. He air dodged into it. Wait, what are you talking about? He hit him first, and then he up smash. That was wasn't that just up smash? Was it like? Let's catch the replay really quick. Oh, it was oh, first hit of of My up bad. air into My up bad. smash. It, yeah, it was an aerial attack. There we go. Bro, I thought he just threw, I thought he just threw out up smash. Honestly. Oh, here no, go. come here first. Okay, forward throw. Still hitting him with these up airs. Ooh. And that grab is so difficult. Nice reaction. That grab is so difficult to avoid because of the movement. Like, in general, it just works so well uh, that she has a grab kill control. Oh, a little bit too far away for that forward smash to connect. Sees the roller coming, though. Has that shield ready to go. Spamming that vine whip as an anti-air option. Mm -hmm. He knew he didn't want the ledge. Wishes is one stock away from being sitting very pretty in grand finals. Yeah, with a 3-0, mind you. Get that ink on him. <laughs> the karate <laughs> chop coming back. out again. Yeah. What an inkling he even learned to do that. If they were uh, further on the stage, he would have flared blitz. Oh, no. Oh, okay, Jackal wow. manages to get back narrowly with the auto snap. Magnet Spot hands. Spot dodge, up smash. This has to be Jackal's moment. Ooh, parries it, but it was a multi-hit, so not going too far. Yeah, playing safe, spacing them out. I'm trying to space out these back airs. Oh, gets the grab. Shoots All those right back airs convinced him that shield was the better option, and he just went and grabbed him. That was a good supply grenade to force a reaction out of Jackal, but he kind of just stood with him and get up at ledge attack range, so he got punished. Playing this stock really well with Squirtle. Uh, we might see a switch now, yeah. We have the, the grab kill confirmed yeah. from Ivysaur. If he doesn't DI it. And the thing uh, is, Pokemon Trainer has the luxury of being able to switch Pokemon depending on what the range is. Right there, he switched to Charizard because Ivysaur would die to up throw up air. Uh -huh. So now he's going over to the Charizard. Charizard might die now. Yeah, I want to say Squirtle, but Squirtle could probably die to like anything. Yeah, he, yeah. Squirtle probably would have died to that. So now we're chilling this Charizard one last if time. If he can get him with a stray anything, really. Oh, sweet shit. spot. Oh, man. Goes for the up tilt and hits him off. Sage thing at 103%. Gets the grab. Forward throw. 161. Literally the smallest hit. A forward air oh, could seal back his face. Back on the ledge. Not where he wants to be. Back air. Back Sw airs are out. He's swinging with that super soaker. Only for the grab. Grab's not going to get him anything but a, a back throw. Just whips him off stage. Tries nice. to get the roller. He get knew he wanted it. Roller is unsafe. He knew he wanted it. Roller is unsafe. Roller is unsafe. Can we see that instant replay, please? You saw him roll right into him. Immediate <laughs> punish. Oh, hey. The battles. Because he shielded it, he was able to just go the instant up smash out of shield. He took away that stock, it. and Jekyll finally putting a point on the board. Two to one. Keeping his cool. Knowing what he needed. Pokemon. Stadium Go! two. He gets the rapid jab. Add some defense down debuff. Again. Ooh. Making him super yellow. So good. Okay, throws the underhand splat grenade. Just a big jackal worried. Switches over to Ivysaur to try to like mix up his recovery a bit. Yeah. With the tether recovered. Back airs back out. Ooh. Okay, we got a little bit of ground. You see him catching him with that forward air. And that's got to be it. Roller. Yeah, I mean, yeah, whenever I hear Pokemon Trainer just say, like, oh, no, or you got this, and then it's because they got rolled, honestly. <laughs> Pokemon Trainer does not like when their Pokemon is stuck in the ground, no matter what type they are. Even if they're ground type, man. 
I mean, it's just all this damage being added to Jackal right now. It's like the bomber after bomber. This is a really good stock from Wishes. Just keeping him at the ledge. <laughs> okay, he's got him at 112%, but like... No way. Very big read. Big brain read with that uh, forward smash, but not, not getting get anything out of it. Goes for the Pokemon swap to avoid the up air. It was a brain read. Ooh, okay, up smash? that was big brain. There you go. I don't know, that was just kind of mash, honestly. <laughs> but it wasn't his fault. It wasn't his fault. You're right. Okay, Jackal sitting at 135. Again, you switching Pokemon to avoid the up air follow up. But if he starts mashing wow, that, nice. Wishes could adapt to it and delay his up air. Good Nair out of shield. Another Nair. Uh, try. It's like he wanted to play neutral, but he also wanted to pressure. Yeah. Hey, he's sitting at 184. Oh. Maybe, uh, maybe a DI mix up. Ah, uh, but Wishes was, was ready. Oh, good stuff. I, I mean, he's just, like, it's not a move on him anymore. I want to say he's immune, but I don't want to jinx him. Not going to be able to die. He's at too high a percent. At this point, Jackal could just... Oh, oh my good big God. answer. Just pushes him get off. off not to get the kill just yet. Sitting at 221%. The thing is, Jackal oh, he just... Wants like, he wants the back throw. He wants the back throw. Jackal go just holds the shield. He's dead. Look at that rage. Uh, wow. Platform. At this point, he Jack just couldn't kill him. Yeah, I mean, at this point, Jackal could just hold shield and he won't die. Because, like, there's nothing, there's no grab. I mean, back throw at the edge could kill from Inkling. Just goes for that back air out of shield. Tricked him. Deleting the stock. Made him think it was safe. Yeah, it wasn't. That's the <laughs> trick. Okay, Squirrel coming back into play. I like the wait before you. Because sometimes. They're just waiting for you to press a button, but if you like just wait it out and then press that same button, you can you can really catch people off guard. Okay, neutral air. So it's so that was confused. Godlike. Stop hitting him. Couldn't believe it. Okay, now 99%. Oh, are oh, we gonna see another? He's at uh, booyah range. Gonna see another grown man uh, flare blitz. No. Oh, what is the downer spike? Fed it all in that. Gave up stage control in the process. That was probably One really grab away. scary for wish Wishes just now. Wishes is hounding for that grab. He, Good, he also uh, doesn't even want to touch him. Yeah. Grab. Boo. Oh, Pokemon. Squirtle. Suited. Yeah, Squirtle coming out. But this is the coming in clutch. Third, third lightest character time with Game & Watch. Got to switch. There you go. Yeah. Ivysaur coming out. Back throw. Trying to chase after him. Didn't the, want it. The longest Force again? Smash charge. <gasps> Catches him with the Vine Whip! Dude! Anti air. Are we coming back? Yo, one more time. You all did great. Cut red such a And nerd. you know he just wanted to get on stage. He yeah. just wanted to. <laughs> it's like, look at that Vine Whip. That clutch Vine That's Whip. That's all he wanted. Dude, real talk, Pokemon Trainer is a nerd. Like, Red, <laughs> you, you hear his voice. <laughs> Go! Go! Go, Charizard! Charizard! You, my, fav <laughs> my favorite is when he just says their name. He doesn't say go anymore. He's so tired of them. Yeah, he's just like, Ivysaur. Like, <laughs> eventually, just be like, go. Like, just you. Go you. Go you. Oh, like go. you mix their names. <laughs> Can you imagine? Like, it's, just like, it's like a, it's like a, a mother. He yeah. just mixes up all their children's name all the time. You know, It's just like, I don't know which one you are. Ooh. Go Pokemon. Yo, he is playing patient right now. Waiting for Jackal to commit to an attack. Just yeah. staying grounded with that ult. I love seeing these game fives because the players know each other at this point. They know each other so well. Ooh. Point blank Razor Leaf. Yeah, not going to bite. Ooh. Don't have to spy grenade once more. See, that move is so cool. It's so, it's so cool looking, dude. Like, she's just like... Does a dance break? Learn it from Mario DDR. Mm -hmm. Oh my God! That splat grenade protecting yeah. him. He, he he wanted to fall off the stage. Yeah. So 
the splat grenade is such a good option to just throw out and have Inkly follow up afterwards because if they try to do something, they get caught by the grenade. Right there, it was a freaking flare bullets. Let themselves wide open for a free forward smash. All of that one grenade. And now Wishes is kind of getting a little carried away here. Could easily go for trades. Forward smashes the punish on the withdrawal on shield. Okay. Finally connects We're a grab. Actually gonna get something, maybe? My man is saying that up there would have taken it. My man is saying oh no, no. you haven't seen it. You Look, caught, when caught. I don't pull it out when for you, a while. When you have a bad day. Yeah, my I don't know. Jackal is definitely saying ellipses right now, just like his tag. He's just lost in thought. <laughs> Super comes back on. <laughs> Dude, he's shaking the whole stage. Dude, it's just like Bowser. Like, man. you're like, not allowed to short hop. Fly out of shield. Good option. I love all these, like, I'm Charizard decisions. Yeah. I'm Charizard. Like, I'm the guy. <laughs> that was very well, <laughs> eloquently put, man. Like, just these Charizard decisions. <laughs> the thing is, this might be coming a little bit too late because Jackal's on his last stock and Wishes yeah. still has one spare. Yeah, can the big brother of the three bring them back? Yeah, dude. I, I don't know. It's looking pretty bleak. But hey, we've seen crazier stuff, you know? Yes, we have. Just today. Okay. Neutral air. Inks him a bit. It's not going to be good for Jackal. Which is pistol whips him off stage. Tried to go for a splat grenade. Didn't have enough ink. Has to charge it. There we wow, go. Wow, he just missed. Chuck him. Down air. Back air. Oh, we got pushed uh, off stage. It. Still has three jumps to get back to stage Better safe and way. sound. Oh, up smash oh, raw. Had, I mean, he, he needed something. Waits that time. That was exactly that. what I was talking about. He was conditioning that Pokemon switch the entire time until the very end. Delayed the up air. Got the kill on Squirtle, who is the one of the lightest characters in the game. And that was over. That was big brain. Big brain. Reed wishes. Moving on was... to Grand Finals. It's hyped to have a Pac-Man, you know? I get it. It is. But I just, I've, like seen, to have I've seen those two one. fight so much in 2015, 2016. Yeah, I'm sure I've heard. That I just, like, I just don't want it anymore. And when it came back in a new game, I'm like, no, please, someone beat them. <laughs> John's not in anymore. No, yeah, John went out pretty early. Okay, but here we go. Pokemon Stadium 2. And Cindy's not even present. Hey, this is uh, quite the neutral we got going on. No one's committing to anything. Odyssey fighting off against <laughs> yeah. Jen and Loser Semis. Loser this getting fourth place at Xeno Soccer 20. Spike him into the, some hit stun. Guarantees the grab. Trying to challenge that up. Like, I like how everyone's ready for that, but like it never happens. Never. Goes for the rapid jab, push him off. Now, okay, so you got Fox, just loves rush downing his opponent. Just wants to get in her face, push get buttons. In the air, get them off their feet. Exactly, and that's all. That's exactly what Audi's doing against Jen. Try to go for a big read with that forward smash, though. Jen saw it coming, went for a ledge type to yeah. get him off here. Meanwhile, he got a lot safer in this game. Yeah, and then you also have Palutena, who is a very quick character as well. It will yeah. go with some very speedy attacks while also having some long range moves to boot, such as, like, you know, the fire blast. Oh, jeez. I feel like their neutrals are, uh, these two characters, their neutrals are, are both like equally good, mm -hmm. but Fox gets more when he gets in. Yeah, Fox, the Fox gets guaranteed kills all the time. Good he, stall! He can actually reflect that. Is that, wait, did he reflect it? I thought he just stalled. Maybe he I mean, did. He did. It, he, is he did stall. It's technically a projectile. Oh, like. not again. Jen! Jen, stop picking the stage. I'm so mad. This stage had, has killed you at that same spot, the same way. Three times. Catches the forward what? Fire fox forward tilt. What? I mean, that staff is definitely a disjointed hitbox. She's not even touching the staff after a point. Using her goddess powers. Dash attack. That looks like. Let's a, go, Di. That looked like sus Di. Yeah, I was gonna say. My man held in. I mean, I'm sure it wasn't the plan yeah. to get hit by it. Uh, that was a bad motion shuffle. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> Up tilt from Adi as he goes back down to the ground. He shuffled in the wrong direction. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to trouble shuffle this man right now. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> Up tilt catches the yeah. landing. Fox just gets more. What a mix-up. Adi not coming to anything before he grabs footstool. Oh, what? How? Is that on purpose? He ran off yep. really quick. The sweet spot is up there. 
Adi is just throwing out these up airs. Jen looking for a Oh, move. he has to see what he can get. Try to go uh, for the spike, and mistimes it, and Jen SDs again. Stop the stage. Jen. Stop the stage. Ban it. Ban it. Je something's got to give for Jen, because that is, I've seen him SD so much today alone, and in that game by itself, two times. Two of your three stocks, gone. 66% of your life, just gone. This is the fourth. The fourth time tonight. Just stop picking the stage. It's not It's not the new Smashville. It's not the vibe. It is the new Smashville. Sadly. I like it. I, I love figure if I say it, it is enough. my favorite stage. Of, it is my favorite stage of all time. Really? Yeah, because I actually, I hate Smashville, so. In Smash 4, whenever, if, if anyone came up to me in the middle and was like, hey, you want to start on Smashville? I'd be like, no, I, I strike Smashville. I'm, I'm that guy. I hate that stage. Speaking of Smashville, we got wow. Town City. Another this is it the first time we're seeing this uh, we, on stream? We had it earlier during Winter's Quarters. Uh, Adi actually picks it. Adi's the only one I've seen actually go to this stage. It's kind of weird I, to it, see the platform not move. Yeah, the platforms are very static here in the hazardous mode. But they do eventually go off screen and then they bring in the next thing. So the stretcher effect is still there. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's interesting. The platforms fade away. Stretcher is not a thing. Oh, really? Yeah. They literally disintegrate. Oh. Oh, wow. Ooh. One of that yep. back here. Sing it, KK. That's how you... Wait. Jen went here. Oh, yeah. This is Jen's counterpick. Yeah, you're absolutely right. But, like, Adi he was the one that has counterpicked this before in the past. Mm-hmm. I wonder if this is just... I like was going to say that, uh, you know, Adi... I mean, Stage helping him out, mm -hmm. but it's it's not it's, helping Jen out. It's looking it's bleak for stage. Jen, honestly. Sour spot trying to follow up with that up air. A lot of empty hops coming out from Adi. And Jen just trying to hit him. Mm -hmm. Adi not biting. Still just gonna play neutral. He knows he just needs like a falling bear. Or back air. That's what I said. Yeah. Oh, I thought you said there. My bad. I heard you. Devin heard. Ooh, down tilt. Pop him up. Fire. All right, Jen looking for the uh, greedy play. with that up smash. Let's go for the safe, simple Dude, the, back air. The thud. It's like you run into a wall or something. A wall of light. Rapid jab? Yeah, tech to jab. Oh, he's good. Oh, what is- No, 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 no! What? What were all those nares doing there? He's memeing out here. It's like, whoa, that looked good. And then he, went, he goes for another one. Whoa, that looked good. He goes for another one. All those nares gave him like 25% damage. That was just sick. You saw he he, he ran back. Yeah. And they're like, wait, wait, wait. wait <laughs> Pivot grab? On. Yeah. All right, Jen's bringing it back. Back throw. Good night. Wow, I'm surprised he had space to, you know, beat that out. Yeah. Okay. Jen is actually looking pretty comfortable. Jen's that dash attack. Oh, it teleports right wasn't, in front of him. Wasn't ready at all. The double dash up there. Again? Jen. Can't get find, find his way back down to the stage. Uh, nice buffer. Go. Uh, we're seeing a lot of empty hops coming out from Adi because Jen is starting Locked to get a little game. shield happy. I mean, I recognize that. Uh, and Jen also recognizes that if he gets grabbed, he's not going to die. Mm -hmm. Which is why he's like doing it so much. But Adi's just going to yeah, capitalize like, on that. Adi's moving so well right now. And I'm sure Jen wants to slow it down, but Odd's just not letting it happen. Okay. Back throw. Opportunity. Oh, thought he was gonna go for a Firefox off stage. Uh -huh. Immediately, like I'm getting out of there. I'm not losing my stock. It's a mix-up at 20%. Man, Audi cannot close this out. Dead. Good. Night. The second Audi with that swing on the ledge, Plus. he had to go for the Firefox. Put himself wide open for that downer to connect from Jen. I just want to look away when that when that happens. Yeah. Right. I just want to look away that you're going to watch the instant replay real quick and uh, just see it yeah, happen all over again. <laughs> Here we go. 
There you go. It's right here. Because he missed the shine. He's yeah. trying to catch it with the shine, but he still had eye frames. And it, if you were to connect to that, it would It's like, you know what's going to happen. You don't want to see it. Yeah. It's like Zuko getting burned. Oh. <laughs> God. Can you imagine I that really, on instant reflex? I literally just watched the final episode. Oh, you did? Of, of that last night. Yeah. That, that's very timely. A Korra or the... Avatar. Very good show. If you guys ever got to watch Avatar Last Ever, go do it. Do but it. But let's jump into game three. Let's do it. Jen versus Adi. Back to PS2. Adi's like, you know what? Jen sucks on the recovery. Is he? Here. But so do I! <laughs> but so do I! <laughs> Dude, can we get... You know how you post the finishers? Can we get, like, SDs? All the <laughs> SDs and see how many of them are on PS2. Oh, I would love to do that. Just have two separate buttons. One for, like, all the SDs. <laughs> play, like, play, like, some, like, very, uh, like... Yeah. All right, get ready for SD's Volume One Let's uh, this Wednesday. Let's go! <laughs> I need a compi compilation, dude. Compilation. Put that on YouTube. Advertise it. We got the H O three K combo video coming near you. It's just everyone just killing yeah. themselves over. And over. I was just wow, that killed so low. Well, I think Jen's taking home this game. What 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 move number is self destruct in Pokemon? Because that's what I'll name. That's the, what I'll name the video. Yeah. The sequel will be called Explosion because they explode. <laughs> New series. Oh, yeah, we'll God, find so find out the TM for that one. Oh my God! What is going on? This is I have three stock. Adi, gen. what happened? This is three stock Jen. Dude, Jen, you can't stop him. You you give you give this kid. You momentum. want to stop him, but you, you can't. Give this kid you can This is what happens. So that was a game. Yeah, I like how he's not acting like, uh, you know, he's not crazy, but yeah. So this first stock, you know, very beautiful, great gameplay coming out from Jen, you know. It's just like, oh, you want an SD? Okay, I guess I'm taking... You want to die again? The three stock? Was that our first three stock? Nah, I don't know. I haven't been paying I mean, attention. in top eight. Top eight. It was, my, it was the first three stock this minute. <laughs> and this set. Ooh. It's he like, got hit by the Fire Fox, too. Lucina. The one. Oh, yeah. This fox is not working. Yeah, he's done. He's out of here. Dunskies. What okay. happened? He, he was, played so well game one. Jen exploded. That's what happened. Jen was just like, I'm going ham with a sandwich and some uh, mayo. Maybe some tomato. All right, let's go. Got him off stage 70% already. Now, this is going to be kind of a different change of pace, right? Because yeah. Adi, again, how you play Lucina is you want to keep him at, like, near the edge of your sword. Keep him at, like, sword's length. But don't be afraid to get in there as well. Because Lucina wants in. Really good spot dodge. And Lucina also has the ability, not Lucina, but uh, Palu also has the ability to kind of back off and throw out projectiles. Very greedy up smash, going to get punished Try to catch it. a jump. Not that hard, though, I guess. Weird, weird uh, interaction. Yeah, that g this entire game has been kind of weird so far. Dude, that was on. That was like in sync, dude. That down throw. Yeah, it was. Like, like I thought. Like wait, I thought wait, the bear is Adi was evolving? <laughs> yeah. Wait. I mean, Jen did last game, so that's fair. <laughs> we might be. Okay, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Explosive it just flame. Covers lead. It co explosive flame stays out for a very long time. Goes through air dodges. Up air. Do it again. One more for me. Okay. That's okay. Not he used to not be able to do that yeah. as well. Because of the end lag on up air was ridiculous, even but, though it was a really good move. But now. But now. But now. Oh, up air. Palu. Oh, he didn't space that. Or maybe he was reading the, uh, the air dodge. Okay. Oh, he's oh, going yeah. pretty deep for that. So Jen That's, I feel like you have to do that as Lucina. Well, Jen was actually chilling backwards, you notice. He actually, instead, of, he was drifting away from him because he knew that I was going to go for something big. And he had the, the recovery to be able to get back to stage from that far away. Counter? That was out for a while. Grab. Down throw. Try to get the forward air. How do you retaliating? Forward tilt. Forward tilt. Keep it simple. Just throw, you have iframes. frames Just throw it out. Why not? Covers a lot of range. Another can like I don't see Jen's like the to real catch. the real cheese Adi can get with Lucina is kind of nerfed by Palutena's recovery. Mm -hmm. It's like you can just teleport to the ledge. Like look, he wants to do something with that, but he knows 
Oh, okay. All right. Cover Ledge instead. Yeah, That's cover Ledge instead. Nice. Stay, keep your feet on the ground. Punish that. Put it jerk. Yes, sir. <laughs> okay. Dolphin slap. Jen was trying to get something going with but that down jerk. air. jerk. He's going for it again. Yeah. Jen was trying to get something going with that down air off of the hit stun, but mm -hmm. Adi just broke it completely with the Dolphin Slash. Just a great combo breaker. It feels stronger in this game. Ooh, down throw. Good DI from Adi. Got DI away to avoid the follow-ups. Oh, yeah. The good nooch. Turn out back here. Adi going deep. Warp gets face. the trump. That's what I'm saying. Lucina's like, she can really go deep. There we go. Dash I was going to say he's playing really good, and then he gets it. Wait. Thing is, uh, ooh, okay, call him out. Okay. Call you jump in. This is the retaliation Jen, this could for Body. either be the last match, or you probably have to fight a Lucina, and this time without your advantage. Adi was trying to, you know, space out that back air. But it's really hard to do that against the Lucina. You know, it got that big ass sword. Follow up. Forward tilt. No way, no way, no way. Like, I, I just refuse to believe. Yeah, right? 141%. <laughs> yeah. I swear if he had SD'd right there, it was gonna. Yeah, no, I, I, was, I was expecting banned. it. Just banned. But Adi's at 153. Hold up. Can Adi bring this back? Can he, he actually do oh, it? I was gonna say he had the stage, but. Oh, Jen just dash attacking. Down tilt. Tap him up. Pop him up yeah, into the blast zone. Adi going down 100%. with a fourth place finish. That Jen, was super clean. Yeah, Jen's going to move on to loser's finals. Keep this loser's train a trucking. I'm really liking like seeing Paolo so often. Paolo's a fun character to watch. Yeah. I'm actually, honestly, I like all the top tiers in this game. They're all, like, that they've, they've shown so far. Obviously, yeah. it's uh, early game, so we don't exactly know we who yeah. all is top tier because there's probably these. There's probably going to be some character that we're not even thinking of that yeah. is actually godlike, but we just like, we like, me brawler. Like, what if me brawler is actually OD? We don't know. But uh, that's the thing. Like, Palutena is one of those characters that I, I you, definitely like. Have watching. you been I hit like, by a side B yet? Oh, yeah. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Like, and, and Jackal. The winner of this is going to move on to Grands to face off against the one and only Inkling Main. Wishes. Wishes. I knew his name. I had it. I ain't ready to go. Yeah, you were just, the back you just of my head. Me I was trying to, yeah, yeah. I was trying to stall for the longest time. I was trying to like think, I was like, dang, what's his name again? Yikes. But yeah, wishes, wishes, wishes. Now we got Jackal versus Jen. Let's get it. Ivysaur fighting off against. Oh, you knew. Oh, in the footstool. Hold on. Dude. <laughs> Hold on. Come on. We just got through a, a whole like nail biting set. Hold on. That didn't just happen. I heard a warp. I heard her say it, and it didn't matter. I heard a whoop. <laughs> this is the only what thing I What is going on here? What is this back Dude, the airs? back airs Jackal. are out. Jet DI. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. All right, Ivy Star, come here. I, I, I thought Jen would have the women to go into this set, but Jackal, my god, doesn't even need any of the Pokemon. Oh, Catches no. the no neutral get up. Jackal is just having a field day. Crosses him over the neutral air. What has been this top eight? It's like, yo, yo Jen, what's going on? Just, I throw that another razor leaf, point blank. I'm trying to see one more SD before a top eight. Oh, 100%. <laughs> it's going to be Jackal this time. Actually, Jackal has yet to SD, so I don't think he will. I mean, because he hasn't, he's like destined to. Oh, you're right. How many times can you do explosive flame? At the ledge, as many uh, as necessary. Yeah, now we got Jackal switching over the Charizard to become a heavyweight. That was an up smash there. Not gonna die to that just yet. That was Dude, any other Pokemon. That Charizard is in pain. You hear him. You hear that grunt. How come our man doesn't get, say no. Charizard? Like Squirtle and Ivy say Ivy and Squirtle, you know? Does he even say Char? No. He, he, goes, he just he's, goes, he's, Yeah, he's just a dragon. <laughs> he's, just, he's not a dragon, yeah, he, though. He's a lizard. He's a dragon. He's not a dragon type. He's fire flying. He's not a dragon type, but he's a dragon. Chill. He's a lizard. All right, here we go. Down throw. A lizard with wings. Yeah. That's a dragon. It's a Pokemon. Uh, clearly not. He doesn't say his name. <laughs> you got me there, honestly. All right, here we go. <laughs> he's Dude, a dare on stage. <laughs> New Jen's been doing that a lot lately. I think it's because he gets a lot of hit stun after it, so it allows him to combo way easier. Uh -huh. Aside from it being funny. Yeah, yeah, aside from it being hilarious. Back throw. 
That's actually Pokemon Trainer's strongest throw. Yeah, it, you toss him, dog. Forward oh. tilt. Oh. My man is done. Nice get-up attack. Here's my tail. Jack was going to be taking away game one away from Jen's Palutena. Now, this is the question. Is Jen going to go to a different stage besides PS2? Is that is he going to do it? No, really? not at all. Pokemon Stadium 2 again. Gen Y! <laughs> Just so he can SD. That's what I want to see. Gen, please. I'm calling it. I'm calling it right now. It's going to be going to be an SD this game. It's going to be Stock 2. Stock 2 is going to SD at uh, 37%. All right. We're going to see how this game goes. Uh, hopefully without the really strong start from Jackal. Ooh. That was a kind of a funny exchange. No one really wanted to commit to anything. But yeah, he, he, as you said, Jackal is rocking this world this time around. He, he was pretty much just Ivysaur into Charizard. Yeah, that down air. That <laughs> down air. The down air is godlike. Grab him. Set him up. Oh, okay. Now you're, now you're just being a jerk. Yeah. You know, you remember this? Remember when I comboed with this? Yeah, remember when I comboed with back air five times in a row? <laughs> the previous game? Oh, oh Cash has spot it. dodge. Call that joint out. Now we got a really strong start from uh, Jack. Oh my god, Jackal tried to spike him. <laughs> nice tech. And it's gonna live the dream. Neutral air into neutral air into Back neutral up. air. Okay. Nice landing decision from uh, Jackal. Yeah. He is really hungry for this down air. Yeah. He wants to close out this I like stock. his responses. Yeah. He, really, he can get really aggressive when, uh, when he feels he needs to be. Like Jack, I feel like Jackal's the one playing with the lead currently, even though he's clearly not. Yeah. <laughs> oh! I mean, he may as well. Yo, high three, dog. Good Pokemon swap. Withdraw to get back on the stage. Using the counter that time around. The thing is, even if Withdraw hits counter, it, it'll do zero yeah, damage to the Because of the darn yeah. super armor. Mm -hmm. Not even super armor. It's, it's just, just it's like nothing happens. It called it out again. Yo, what the heck, Jackal? I think you have a spot dodge. Yeah, was he and just Jen taking, is capitalizing on it? Was was uh, Jen just taking notes the entire last game? Oh yeah. I mean that's that's kind of been Jen's mo, right? Like that previous set that he won, he lost game one against Adi, <laughs> and then he downloaded it. I think that's, that's what's going that's on. That's so true. Jen is the master. He does this in friendlies too. Like I'll, we'll be playing friendlies like rotations with everyone in. He loses game one all the time, and then after that, brings it back. Three stock. Three stock. Man, just needs that data for download. Down tilt out. Oh, air dodge in the ledge. Jenna, uh, Jackal did SD. Now, You're right. He's not Whoa, immune. Whoa, what? Hold on. He did. He's not immune. You're absolutely right. Yeah, it makes him more likely to SD that he was like the only one in top of it who didn't. Yeah. So now, game three. Can we get a replay? One. Uh, on, the, on the SD. Yeah, no, we need to replay yeah. on the SD, please. please. Helper, please! We've been counting them. We've been counting all the SDs. We're currently at 17 today. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's a They're lot of so SDs. PS2 yeah. again. Let's go. Oh, no. Why even have it's a gonna big stage? Why time. even have a big stage, though? All you need is PS2. Right? You guys went out of your way. Nah, just like five stages, dog. That's all we need. Hell, just make it three. Just do, copy the Japan stage list, man. At least we'll get variety. <laughs> it's really three in Japan? Well, in Japan, it's uh, Final Destination Game 1, Battlefield Game 2, PS2 Game 3. No counterfeits, no nothing. Oh, wow. Yeah. And it's like, with that rule set, we would get more variety than what we're seeing today. So just yeah. saying. Yeah. I'm not having a game for that rule set. Uh, it, I, I, I do agree we need stages variety. But I think it's just people that just being comfortable on PS2, you know? Mm -hmm. That's all it is. It's comfortability. People yeah. don't really know what to counterpick yet. I banned it like five, six times. <laughs> oh, you want you want to start on um, PS2? No. Like, I played a whole doubles bracket on PS2. Ooh. No, I want to start on uh, WarioWare. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Get Get him off the one. I'm, try I'm trying to kill someone at 50, dog. Like, <laughs> oh! Call him out. Forward I was smash? gonna say missed op opportunity with the razor leaf to vine whip, but no. Uh, but he just made smash. it work. He just made it work. Body slam. So that's probably what that move is, honestly. Body slam. I thought it was that. Oh. I'm thinking it's takedown. Takedown? You could probably just like. I don't even know what takedown is. I don't play Pokemon. Oh my god. About to take him down to, <laughs> to the last second. Yeah. My god. 
Nice pick up down tilt the back air or forward air, I mean, and it's pretty it's solid. It's like our weakest area when it's yeah. kill. Well, if it's sweet awesome. spot, it's very similar to like Zelda's, you know? N no, it's not. It's, I mean, yes, it's not as powerful as Zelda's, but it's okay. You're in the, it's you, okay. You're in the ball. It kills! <laughs> Something. It killed, did it not? It, it, all right, all right. <laughs> it, it shouldn't, it? it shouldn't, but it did. It, do, it, it did. It will. Oh, chased him. Withdraw. The it's thing. not even withdrawing at all. The thing is, he withdraws into a shell. That's why it's called withdraw. See? It's gone. The thing is, Jackal has yet to get punished for that. I mean, you you have to really call someone out. Yeah, and if you Either do, that or you just wide let it open. Happen. Yeah. So if you get a little bit too antsy, it's like, okay, I'm just going to jump on you. Or hit you with a multi-hit. Damn, like, dude. honestly, forward tilt from Palo would probably beat out with draw. That was actually kind of scary, all those uh, Charizard hitboxes. Oh, try to challenge the recovery. Has warped, oh, saved his wow. double jump. Yeah, he kept it. Very valuable resource. I called out the spot dodge again. It was just a little too far. enough. <laughs> Send him back. Didn't take any damage. I don't want him. I don't want this. This is when you hit run when you run into a wild Pokemon. Yeah. Whoa! Uh, oh, okay. SD. Wouldn't be, I wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> Wait, I missed it. Did, was it the stage? We'll see it momentarily, you know. He messed up the... Yeah, he messed up his warps recovery. I was just, he leaned too much to the left. Yep. But here we go. <laughs> Let's go, SDs. Jen rocking that damage. <laughs> that one's going to be a funny one, by the way, because it actually looked like, it looks like cool. a cool clip. It looked really <laughs> cool until he looked like a fool. Ooh, wow! He slid into that. Shut up, Red. <laughs> you hear him? Did Charizard, Charizard even do a good job? <laughs> if he did a good job, he'd still be here. Yeah, honestly, real talk. All right, 77 percent, 73. Pretty even game. Gonna pop him up. Oh, all the way My up. My man is light. Squirtle's a light character. You're gonna die to that. Charizard wouldn't die to that. Just saying. Damn it, Red. Wow, she's so rude. Too bad for you. <laughs> Damn it, Red. Yeah, he just had to call Charizard and back. Jen's adaptation is coming into full fruition, man. You know what would be the best? Last game one, won the next two. What's up? What would be the best? Pokemon if, Red. like, down B wasn't a thing. Who's, oh, where, for Pokemon Yeah, where Red decides all, which Pokemon plays at any given moment. All three stocks are a different character. No, no, no. Not even that. It's like, you oh, don't changes know. Oh, changes randomly? You don't yeah, control Yeah, yeah. You don't know. when. <laughs> Oh, what are you on? Get up, and wh where can I get some? Oh, right, you got the neutral letters coming out from Jen. On well, the platform goes for, uh, I'm sure, the dare to the bear. So you're kind of saying like you're bodying someone real quick, and then he just goes return, and yeah. just like, ah, right, I guess, and, and I guess like, Red thought I was too good. <laughs> <laughs> or like you're off stage and you need Charizard's recovery, but and he, he goes like Squirtle, go, and it's like, what are you doing? <laughs> He's a, ten year old kid. he's a 10 year old kid. There's no way his strategy is evolved <laughs> exactly. such a good level, you know? He hasn't learned to think ahead. He's yeah, actually 100%. Ash. <laughs> okay, good response. You're not going to congratulate him too much, though. Oh, my lord. I'll congratulate that, though. You want to go win? I got this F smash. If, you, if, I mean, if it works again, or the first time, just do it again. Who cares? Oh, where are you going with that roll? I can tell uh, that was a Jen goal. likes grabbing midstage. For like a split second, I thought Jackal was gonna. Ask. He's still spot dodging, by the way. Oh, 100%. And Jen's like, he's gotta be thinking about it. He's waiting for a. I'm gonna uh, do the craziest thing next time he spot dodges. Yeah. <laughs> be careful. Spot dodge again. Yeah, Jackal. It, it might be some nervous reactions. Maybe he's playing a little scared because he wants to get the grants. He wants to run back against wishes and grands, you know? That's true. Jen might deny it. Heck, you're not. Super deep for that, but the super armor from Fly is going to save Charizard's life. Yep. Up smash. Not going to do it. He's going to hit break before running into it. Oh, first time we're seeing that jab. Coming out. And jab's out again. He's like, oh, yeah, I have this button. Oh, yeah. That's, act that's actually uh, not that bad. Well, how about that? Dash attack still living. Charizard's a big boy. He's going to go off stage. No, he's not going to challenge the... But he will That's challenge the really forward tilt. Yeah. Like, letting go of the ledge and double jumping back onto the stage, a very unsafe option. And we'll Especially see. immediately. Or if you do it, even if it's not immediately, if you keep getting back on stage the same, like, amount of time. Right. Like, I'm going to wait one second. I'm going to hit a button. 
like doesn't like your opponent really doesn't have to read like what you do. It's like when you do it. Okay, forward throw. He's been missing those follows. Everyone all right? Yeah. Everyone's okay. But except Jackal. Jackal's not okay. Yeah, we might need a head count in a second. Try to go for a punish. That uh, was a really close razor leaf. Yeah. And Jen put on the brakes. Ooh, big punish. Not gonna do it. We might be seeing the he went Zard. Super deep for that tether recover. Super oh safe. My God. Super safe. That back air is so good. Try to go for the jab. You thought jab was safe? Hell no. We're backing up with that forward smash. Jack was at 122%. Checking the platform. I tried to punish. Just barely missed it. Hashtag not enough to get that kill just yet, but he's Zard, searching yes. for that up air. Switch over All right, to Charizard. Boy. We're back. You miss me? <laughs> you Yo. see me every Yo. like every triple digit percent. I always come in at the me. most inconvenient moment. Yeah. <laughs> it's just making day harder. It's like that back air would have killed oh Squirtle. Oh my god. And Jackal's making it work. Trying to space that. Not gonna die. Bro. Okay, oh, okay. I, 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 I'm sorry. I, I thought he Charizard, pummeled for a while. I was that thinking Charizard was Bowser for a second. The ultimate pummel. Yeah. But here we go. This is could potentially be Jackal's final stock if Jen makes this move. Using Pokemon Trainer. Oh, he's back. Swap, swap back over to Charizard to avoid the follow-ups from Paladin. Smart stuff. Yeah. Again. Uh, but the follow-ups are back out. Yeah. Uh, I mean, this character he, harder to combo, but in mid percents now. The thing is, if Jackal keeps doing that, Jen could just do what Wishes did to him at the end and delay it and go for a big meaty punish. True, true, true. And the damage of crap is slowly starting to come. Wait is that an air dodge this time. Throughout the, the parry point. not going to really give him any real estate. Jen has him off stage. Okay. Doesn't want to go for the big punish just yet. Doesn't want to overcommit. No punish on the oh, and Somehow uh, Jackal ends up in mid stage. Gets popped out by the surprise dash attack. Back here off of the air, grab. Back and Jen is going to take out that was, Jackal. That was straight from Diddy. Yeah. The back air back air. Good stuff to Jen. Yeah, like I said, again, Jen lost game one and then proceeded to win the Literally, next the same three count. games. The same it, count. Exactly. He's the king of adaptation. Let's see if he can actually adapt because he's moving on to grand finals if to face off against Wishes, wishes. who sent him to losers. If he lo We got the Amazon Prime. We, get, we sure do appreciate it. Here we support. go. Grand finals. Xeno Saga. We got SS fighting against Chu 2. Now, Chu 2, brand new uh, inkling. We haven't seen oh, him before. This in the bracket. You know? Well, oh, yeah. <laughs> You're no, confusing the heck out of me. <laughs> no, this is Jen versus Wishes. Jen playing uh, Palutena with Wishes rocking the inkling. What did you call uh, Wishes? Uh, SS2 or something. I don't remember what it was. <laughs> Whatever his tag is. SS. No, Chu 2. Chu 2, like his game oh, tag. Okay. Yep. So for those that aren't, aren't aware, you know, this is Grand Finals, so if Wishes wins this set, he wins the tournament. If Jen wins this set, he has to win yet another set because Wishes has not lost a set this entire tournament just yet. That is how double elimination brackets work. Yep. Uphill battle for uh, for Jen, definitely. Mm -hmm. and, you know, another way to think about it is this is the second set of best three of, two of three sets between these two guys. If you want to think about it like that because Wishes I feel, won. I feel like that's more complicated. Yeah. No, I mean, it's the best two of three sets. Wishes won set one. Whoever, whoever wins two sets wins the tournament. Not Damn. that they were meant to play three sets. Yeah, yeah. But it's fate, Not, dog. It is fate it, it, that Jen made it all the way if, here from losers. If, if Jen uh, loses game one, then, then, then it's, it's fate. fate. Then it's fate. All right, all right, The thing is, he's already got some data from the previous set they encountered, you know? Yeah, he does. Uh, and it didn't seem to, you know, help him out too much in the last set. Uh, but we'll see if, you know, another set makes Ooh. the difference. Good recovery from Wishes. He actually used the ink from Super Jump to mess up Jen's recovery, so he's able to capitalize on it. Yeah, that really fudged him over. What if he's playing the long game? What if instead it's um, instead of winning match? Listen, matches, we can we can fan theory this. He loses this. the the we, first set. Jewel, we can fan theory this to all win day. the next two. We can fan theory this all day, but man, let's just talk about the game. <laughs> <laughs> Wishes at 143 percent maximum. Wow. He's going to jab right through it. Yeah, I mean, parries don't really do too much in a rapid jab. I mean, you can keep parrying, but yeah. you'd be a over, jerk. Over. Like, pull, pull out that evil moment, 37, you know? Okay, here we go. Jumping uh, away from the roller. Yeah. Get that out I want to say the king of avoiding uh, splat roller was uh, Jackal. Oh, yeah, yeah. He was, he was really good at it. He never got touched by it. I mean, Jen is also one that was doing a pretty good job. 
Wow, whiff punish. Unfortunate for wishes. And he's out of ink too, so you really can't do anything. Right now he does not have splat grenade. He's in gonna his he's gonna do something something because they they notice, they know that they need you off stage. Yeah. Uh, and they know you know that you don't want to be off stage. You want to just pressure them. So they'll just play around you, toss you really quick. Like that. You know, give them the booyah combo, the up throw up air. The good booyah. The good booyah. The cyborg. Oh, yeah. Teen Titans. I remember that. He does say that. Oh, yeah. He says it. Zeldin from Final Fantasy VIII says it. Who else says it? Uh, Yo, someone at me with who else says, says booyah. Wishes says it a lot. Wishes does say it a lot. Look at him. Now, one thing that you gotta keep in mind when you're fighting against Inkling, or hell, even fighting as Inkling, is you gotta look at the ink meter right next to uh, Inkling's uh, portrait. Because if that goes below that little line, she loses an option. She no longer has access to splat grenades, which is a huge tool in her neutral. So, it, little, and if you run out of ink completely, you just become a bad character. So you just you don't you never mm. want to go into that. So you gotta make sure to charge up your ink whenever you find a free moment. Yeah. Uh, but up until this point, Jen just chasing his landings. Now we're playing more of a neutral. Okay. Okay. I'm always scared when that happens. Yeah, Wishes is one grab away from potentially closing out this game. Got some more rage to play with. Banger, you're going to send him off. Uh, Wishes playing this perfectly. Jen is really. And then he gets dash attacked. I knew it. I knew yeah, it. There he I goes. knew it. Get some ink on you. Triple digit lead, though. Yeah, this is a pretty strong lead for Wishes. Got a huge uphill battle for Jen, but we've seen him come back from worse. Playing around those platforms, doesn't want Waiting. to risk getting rollered or grabbed to boot. Yeah, that's one thing about Jen. He's not going to get uh, nervous. Right now, if Jen gets grabbed or rollered, he is dead. So you know Wishes is going to be able to watch out for, for an active hitbox and, and a grab. I don't think grab's going to work anymore, but roller's still an active thing. Neutral air. Try to get with the explosive flame. That nice. Recover high, but Jen, reaction time too quick. Jen bringing like it I back. Like I said, he's not going to. It's a high stakes situation, but, you know, he's still playing the best hit. Oh, that was a back air free, but he accidentally footstooled. Well, he was in the middle oh. of. The... Oh, God. He's in a he, bad he, he spot. He should be all right. Barely uses the 90 hands to get back to the stage. 86%. Has to be on the lookout. Wishes is definitely oh, still wow. looking for that he's roller. Just park right in front of him with the shield, and Jen. Just gonna grab him. Oh, that was scary. That that was back throw and the end of the game. Go, uh, and to the super jump again. Off three cover high. Oh, the, the landing, landing from landing super hitbox. jump pushed Jen away. Jen was a little too antsy. Up oh, smash is gonna steal. talk about antsy. Still living. Okay. <laughs> oh, that oh, nice. Reverse aerial thought, rush back air. I thought a dash attack from Jen was coming. But I think before even Jen could. Uh, it's so sad because that was Jen's game to win. If he, if he just would have punished the squid jump correctly. Also, Solid Tony, thank you so much for the uh, three months uh, resub. Thank you so much, man. We appreciate that. But yeah, if he just would have punished that correctly. If we can get see that instant replay really quick, Devin. Oh, just like that second death. The, the squid jump. Oh, he didn't get it. it uh, no, when he when he whiffed the punish on squid jump. It's okay to get it. it. Yeah, it's all good. But regardless, he like squid jumped onto the stage, and there was a free forward smash for Jen to seal it out. Then he got caught by oh, the squid yeah, jump, yeah. and he just knocked him out of it. If he just would have shielded it, and went for like something safer, like forward tilt out of shield, would that have killed? Maybe, maybe not. But it definitely. He did. He had a ton of rage. Yeah, it would have given him stage control, and that's what's actually important. Or if he would have F smashed earlier, really, yeah, for the landing. Catch him before he lands on the ground. Yeah, or up smash. I mean, I, I'm sure Jen's thinking about all these yeah, things. Yeah, but he can't reflect on the past. You yeah. gotta learn from it and move on. That's exactly what Jen needs to do, but it's not exactly what's happening in practice. It's tough. You had it close. You had it all in your hands, man. The dream was within sight, and Wishes is just uh, taking your wish. I love how consistent uh, Wishes has been as well. He's been on point. Neutral air, squid jump. Right idea. I think you should always challenge that. Because the explosive flame again pops him up with the down tilts. Kills him with the explosive flame nice. this time around. Jen taking away the first stock, even though he had a clear dislead that whole time. Oh, good Whoa. air dodge. The and good combo. DI after. Booyah combo was not going to connect there. And they, 
Tries to auto reticle. Why not? Punishes the uh, roller. Not safe. It should be a mix up. They should be like, okay, you punish my jump. I'm gonna just go past you mm -hmm. instead. Uh, but you know, it's still new. Okay. We live in good DI from Jen. Sage's good double jump too. That not gonna live that up there. Yeah, he chased him. England's got a really strong up there. <laughs> there we go. He probably wanted the plat. Nice roll read. Forward tilt. Back air. Gonna give him back uh, stage control. See what he does with it. Just gonna. Was that a dash or a roll? I, I missed it. Probably it was a roll because he got behind him. I was sitting at 95%. Back in the looking for the landing. Land. He was definitely looking for that up air. Rapid jab again. Get that he ink just, on him. Defense yeah. down on Palu. Just following him. Okay, back throw for stage control. It's like Punch. they're taking... Good pick up. Really good. Getting the two frame on the squid jump. They're taking turns uh, getting advantage, but Jen is the one uh, actually tossing him off stage. You know, this is what we foretold, dog. Jen lost game one, so... Oh, yeah, he did. So... He's dead. Yeah, he's actually, like... Good night. I'm surprised. That was, like, the best punish. And he and Wishes just did it like it was nothing. Blind it up. Forward air into forward air into... That platform seems to benefit him a lot. I see why he keeps picking the stage. Yeah, the platform it's... helps out a lot. He just needs to work on his recovery. Yeah. Oh, oh my god, what Wishes, a nut. you're... <laughs> My man is crazy. We talked about how crazy Wishes is, right? Oh, no, we're talking about Jackal. No, we're talking about uh, Tilda. Tilted. Yeah, Tilda. Tilda's crazy. Yeah. They're all crazy, honestly. Anyone who <laughs> plays Smash Ultimate. There it is. They're, they're all nuts. All right, here we go. 106%. Interesting uh, ledge trap there. Reflects the ink back right back at him. Yeah, nice. Didn't want to land on stage because of the reflected. Gets the booyah. Oh, my God. Not that was so to close kill. to killing. I think he's still in Booyah percent. Yeah, maybe? he. I, I think he is. Not now anymore. he's not. Yeah. Especially with the rage. Oh, oh that roller was out. Oh, that was scary. Down tilt into. Nice. Not enough to and get the kill. And he's No. There. Forward. Air. Oh no, the ink jump. No! Super jump messed up his recovery. Are you serious? I think that was an air dodge. Maybe. Let's, let's we'll watch the replay. Yeah. Here we go. So we had the photo finish, but... Oh, yeah, that was ink. Yeah, that was ink. Because the, the, the ink off of Super Jump pushes you mad far. And if you use your double jump, it's over. Especially not if you're not ready for it. And that just sucks for Jen because he had the photo finish. Yeah. It was there and now wishes. wishes. One game away from taking home Xenosaga 20. The first monthly for Ultimate. It looked like he had it with the fair. Yeah, But honestly, again, the fair doesn't kill. You know? Not at all. As I said. Good for combos, look. Ooh. <laughs> wow. Dude, the last hit, the last hit of Nair uh, into whatever Palo wants reminds me of the last hit of Dare for Fox. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Trying to get that up air afterwards. Mm -hmm. Now, at this point, dash, Jen, dash out, dash in. Yeah, that was a very good bait coming out from Jen. He's trying to play a little bit more cautious, I think. Yeah. Just covering, like, the. Play more reactionary. Oh, gets the booyah. Is it the booyah if it if it doesn't kill? Yeah, sure. Like hoo ha doesn't kill. Sometimes. It did. That's why we started calling it the hoo ha. No, the hoo ha just like ding dong. Also, like that doesn't have to kill either. It ju it's just it's, it's just signifying up the rubber, you know. Yeah, really good uh, teleport cancel to get back to mid stage. Okay, 129. That was a very they, they try to They try to sneak sneak yeah. those onto you. <laughs> you gotta sneak that in. But Aha, you have advantage, you think. You thought. Yeah, you thought you did anyways, yeah. You get, uh, get Nair. Close it out. He's been catching a lot of people like jumping from the ledge with his Nair. Uh, and it's been working out. Yeah, there's such a long-lasting hitbox. Very good option. Combos. Let's get out of shield. Yep. I thought that was another uh, thud from the shield. Yeah, could you imagine? This is the gun. Dude, the, the gun and the shield make the same sound. 
They're both super soakers. The shield's not a super soaker. Yeah. Okay. You're right. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, just trying to play around that shield. Knows that Jen was looking for a grab or something. I can never tell if it's like a roller or a, like. Yeah, I mean, they look very similar. It's tough. That was dashing. <laughs> yes. I'm calling you, it out. You are correct, sir. Forward tilt? Yeah, upward angle. Wow, so. So good and so cool. Back throw? Down throw. Oh, that's not a kill throw. Next one might do it, though. 215%. Oh. How do you get out of that? All that pressure. How is Jen alive? Ah. Down throw. <laughs> I didn't even know that killed. Oh, it's hot? You got, you got Wumi? He's got to get pumped up. Wumi. Oh, that was so cool. Yo, he is moving. Wait, hold on. He's doing his thing. Wishes. Chill. He's doing his thing. It's not done. Yo, this advantage state is ridiculous. He's not done. Oh my god. 90. Yo, is he about to get zero death? Whoa, oh my <laughs> god. Dude, what the heck happened? I what the heck happened? The jump. <laughs> that was a zero death, dog. I don't think that he even touched That was legit Wishes. less than 20 seconds. Oh my god. Which is one stock away from taking home this tournament, and Jen's got to make a power play. Rapid jab, tackle wow. on defense down. Wishes turned. It was up. so. It, it was in his favor and everything. Go stack it up. He gets that grab. Jen needs that same thing to happen for him, if he wants to. If he wants to have a chance. Yeah, of he did, I mean, obviously, he's at 80 percent. His final stock, tournament stock, potentially. He's got. First off, he's got. Oh no! Oh, he oh, messed, messed it up. He's not used to getting it anymore. Yeah, it's like, yeah that's the <laughs> thing. Like, like, they everyone don't get, avoids They it. don't land it anymore, so they don't know how to deal with it anymore. <laughs> that's actually pretty funny. Oh, an inkling's out of ink, dude. Uh, Look how low that ink is. Charge it. Remember what I... Oh, he almost ended it the same way he ended uh, Jack. Yeah. He, so right now, inkling doesn't have access to Splat Bomb. A lot of her smash attacks won't work anymore until it charges. There we go. 142. This is looking like Wish's Moving tournament, so dude. Fast. This is looking like Wish's tournament. Jen yeah, it is. cannot escape faints. Wishes taking home with a 3-0 victory, winning Xenosaga 20 in dominant fashion. Did not drop a set. Can we talk about that second game though? <laughs> that second stock. Holy crap. That was just disgusting. Dude, that that entire stock was a clip. Yeah, that entire like did you, did you get a long enough replay for that in heaven? My god. That was yeah, but congratulations to Wishes. You that know, was like 20 seconds long. Comment.